Look how cool he is. Whoever that guy is. It ain't gonna be me, I think, because I can make my own character. Yeah, the pup rich horror. His name is just Ronin. Can we name him Sid? Is that is that Ronin? He's got a gauntlet like Vincent. No, I haven't made my character yet, so we're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna be here a while. Everyone's so cool already. Oh. Yo, he's got the- <laughs> he's just chilling. <laughs> the owl is us watching this go down. Sound like Luffy. Ew, get out of here. Damn. <laughs> That's a pretty cool intro. <laughs> I know, right? Ew, a Westerner. That was cool. Uh, this is the Battle of Onigashima. Yeah, we saw- we heard Luffy, we saw Orochi. Basically, Onigashima. Grey's Anatomy is the one piece for white women. <laughs> I, I've never watched a Grey's Anatomy, so I can't really- so I can't agree to that, I don't know. A barbarian! I'm gonna save Momonosuke? Nope! Let's get my options real quick. Game settings. Three sets. I don't I don't even know why I'm wait, a show headgear? Never. I wanna see my face. Well we can see it. <laughs> the gra the gray's anatomy is real. Look the way I thought some guy's name was show headgear. <laughs> <laughs> Think about that. Yo, lock on marker. Yes. You think? Yeah, I want to wear. Oh my god, you're right. I was thinking about wait, Law's Wano hat, and then I remember it's the freaking basket. Yes. Oh, <gasps> I could be Law. Anyway, I don't know why I'm in options because I don't really know what I need to change yet. Wait, I might need to change. Is there like motion blur or some crap? I'm sure it's fine. Visuals. Motion blur off. Yes. Prioritize FPS. Uh huh. Okay, difficulty. Dawn, dusk, twilight. Oh my god, we're back to that horror game. Guys, does. What order do these events happen in? What comes first, dawn, dusk, or twilight? Because I guarantee you everyone's gonna have a different answer. <laughs> anyway. It's because I think the game said Twilight is before dusk. Anyway, the seven one something something. Um, I'll play on medium. Confident in my skills. I mean, I don't want to show off, so I'm gonna go with dusk. Yeah, I think this game does have the right order. I went back to watch that. I was like, oh my god, I know, right? Like they got it wrong. All right, it's a fictional story. Should show off. Like, centuries ago, Japan wait, under the Tokugawa this game is English. What? I assumed it wouldn't. Its doors to the rest of the world. For a time, the island nation prospered. <laughs> wait, I knew that because of Greg. Never mind. I think I just got surprised anyway. Strict surveillance in public 
No, I I forgot about the Greg connection for like a split second. That's why I'm like, wait, no, that makes sense. <laughs> no, English voice acting is fine. We're not laughing at it. That's kind of like Onigashima. The Greg connection. But the Shogun's forces got wind of the plan. Took terrible and bloody Ooh. Damn. The Greg connection sounds like Miami connection, the movie. Uh oh. Did this guy they did not count on another type of weapon being forged in Kurosu. Warriors known as the Veiled Edge. Veiled Edge? Who's that? Skilled in Lord Subterfuge in the way of the sword. These nameless assassins were unmatched in their abilities. Nice. They honed their skills in pairs called Blade Twins. Oh, is that them? Well, one's gonna grow up to look like Frieza, so... Separately, formidable. Together, unstoppable. Aww. Blade twins are forever tied together by the bonds of fate. The bonds of fate, yes! I already love this story. And that's them now. They both look so hot. Yo, I got a s default default blade twin. Well, how do I switch to the L one? Both of them pretty hot already. <laughs> make Law and Beppo. <laughs> All right, can we make Frieza? Look, this is <laughs> it's just like springing like orange. This is what Dragon's Dogma needs. Yes, let's look at hair options. Okay, let's 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 take a look at these hairs. I love this hairstyle though. Can you move the clothes? Oh, I can. Wait, how do I move, remove the clothes real quick? Whoa. <laughs> I, I didn't do it, it's the game. Yo, freaking Daigo hair. That's that's either like, that. that's like Akiyama hair. That could be Kiryu. <laughs> Kiryu hair. Whoa. Wait, there's, okay, that's basically he hair. <laughs> Whoa! Okay, wait, hold on. I want to see. I want to see this, but okay, there's the bangs. That is so sick. This is what we need. Oh my god, look at him. Oh my god, he's so hot. Is there like a one bang? There. <laughs> yeah, we can make vice. <laughs> 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 no way! <laughs> this character creator is so good. Look, isn't it cool how you could just make purple and then like change the shade? This is the best character creator. Look, we can make Frieza. He's got he's got a lot. All right, hair. Because I was only gonna pick this hair if I couldn't add markings on his head. Okay, I think we will. I think it only goes to their forehead, right? Body, <laughs> he's so fail. It's happening. Feel that crater in his face. Anyway, we're gonna need. I mean, I could probably just use these lines. I can't rotate anymore that way. Maybe this way. Not sure why you can't fully rotate it. Yeah, like that is that was weird. I mean, real realistically, it should be like the smallest one, just because he doesn't normally have that. Okay, no eyebrows. We'll we'll change the the face shape in a second. Look, he's already looking like more like Frieza. Isn't it crazy that you just have purple? Frieza had hair, he'd have a top knot? I think he would. To put the white face paint on him. Um I yeah, because now that I have the hair, I have room for the face paint. Sorry, I'm like hopping all over the place. Yes! <laughs> Wait, it doesn't cover his whole face. <laughs> it just actually just looks like face paint. Oh, now he's just gonna look 
really sickly light bulb head. <laughs> yeah. He needs to learn how to blend. <laughs> okay. We need to do something about this, though. Okay, so maybe if I put it, like, under his eye... Look, it's, like, hiding under his eye a little bit. Um... But I can't make it any taller, which sucks. <laughs> it's just gonna look like a rock or something. I'm just gonna... I'll just... I, I'm just gonna go for... This one. He's cute. <laughs> He's so cute. Yo, you can make a butt chin! Let's go! <laughs> Frieza! Frieza with a butt chin! <laughs> Giga Frieza, yeah! <laughs> Came out a little too strong with Meteor. It's so well finesse. Dude, I, I, should I make Frieza and Sephiroth? <laughs> sure. I was gonna make the other guy me, but if it's if I try to make Sephiroth, that'd be even funnier. Well, it makes sense! Two, two men who wanted to take over the world or some crap, destroy the planet, some bullshit, you know? Two, two men, that was their goal at some point, have been humbled by the protag and their friends. Look, okay, he's so cute. I really wish I could make his eyes bigger, though. Again, like, seriously, look at Neo's. Look. Like, he's not as, like, cutesy, but, like... Oh, you know what? I think I think makeup will make a big difference. But that's how he looked in Neo, too. It was so good. I have to change his lip color. I have to see what his eyebrow actually looks like. <laughs> I was gonna say, it probably looks something like this. Yo, look at all these body markings. Tattoos. Oh, she could basically be Majima. Dude, you could straight up just make all these Yakuza characters. <laughs> a freaking onesie of tattoos. Jeez. Here, let's, let's do this so people see Frieza and then they take off his clothes and they're like, holy shit. See, the, ch the chin tip, like, he's got a really tiny... Like, I don't know. I wish I wish I could make it that pointy, but, like, smaller, but I can't. Like, this is the most I can do it. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> that is crazy. I th I think he's kind of cute. I, th I He's like... This is like Frieza, my son, who I want to take care of. I'm not gonna color his nips. <laughs> I, I can't, but... He's ready for night out He's so pretty, right? He's just a little guy. <laughs> I'm gonna make, like, tall-ass Sephiroth. Eyeshadow his eyelid will make his brow stand out more? Maybe. He's so cool! <laughs> I really like how he turned out. The, the, sh the shades around his eyes. Like, the blush. The blush helped. Freeze is back. Oh my god. I think he looks pretty good. Tiny little ears. The cheek peek. <sighs> yep, it's Frieza for you. Well, I was gonna make me my adventure with Frieza, but I think I can make Sephiroth. Yeah, they have the Crisis Core hair. Let's see, <laughs> if Sephiroth had a beard. Oh, where's the eyelashes? Hold on, eyelashes need to be maximum. Whoa. Okay, wait, you know what? He's looking... <laughs> I think I might make him that, because he's he's looking a little, like, green, Frieza is. Okay, Sephiroth's not that pale. It's better. Okay, <laughs> he's too. <laughs> Eyelash length, maximum. <laughs> oh my god, Sephiroth. <laughs> freaking... <laughs> The thought of him wearing false eyelashes is so funny. <laughs> You're so fabulous. All right, we're gonna we're gonna keep that for a bit. All right, lipstick color. <laughs> he is definitely wearing some lipstick. Okay, I don't. It's like it's definitely like a pale purple. Like he's almost like it's almost like corpse esque, and it's his lips are pretty glossy. Wish I could make his hair longer. I need to do something about these eyelashes. <laughs> oh, I think that's better. Cause they don't they don't flare up, they flare out. When he's batting them around cloud. Except for my drag persona, he just puts on false eyelashes and like nothing else changes yet. <laughs> Tara Banks got hold of. <laughs> okay, well you know, I think the glossiness <laughs> it's too much. Wait, it can't be any less glossy! Oh, Sephiroth's glossy. Okay, hold on. I gotta do something about these eyelashes. 
<laughs> okay, I, that's that's better. And his eye angle. Anyway, here's my other guy. Yeah, <laughs> and he looks good. Best I can do. Yo, I just realized we can add mustache. <laughs> this. Sephiroth, when he's trying to blend in and spy on Cloud, he just puts on a fake mustache and just hopes no one notices him. It's, that's freaking Law does that and Dress Rosa. There now. <laughs> just too mad about it. <laughs> the leather bar. Sephiroth, you're not fooling anyone. But those eyes. I need to do something about this guy's face. Face shape. I don't know, he's- he's- his chin... Chin size... Small. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Cause he's so fucking beautiful in my other screen. <laughs> I look at this guy. <laughs> it makes me laugh every time I look over. <laughs> I can't. can't. Oh, the cheekbones. What does Sephiroth's cheekbones look like? I shadow. Well, th this- this is good because- Okay, no, this- <laughs> Stop! No, this is good for for his. <laughs> I can't even get my thoughts. <laughs> I can't even get my thoughts out because, like, even in <laughs> Dust Stranderoth, because it's it's part of the process. But then I see him with makeup, and he's so pretty. And then lower the opacity so that it's like, because he's got like. Like, see what I mean? Like, that's what I've been trying to get. <laughs> see? Yes! That! Okay, more... Okay, I need to do some- This lighting is- You look so good in this lighting, mister. <laughs> mister. <laughs> I know, everyone keeps saying if I can change his nipple color, but I can't! Well, let me, I'm sorry. Smile! <laughs> I think his eyes are pretty good. It's it, it's it's like it's got that purple like I'm tired look to it. It's like his eyes. I don't know. It's it's not gonna. The problem is because the the bangs are short. This is like the best I can get it though. It's the best I can do. I think it looks okay. I think he's pretty. I think I think I did a pretty decent job. There's definitely always more that I could do, but I don't have. I'm not looking at every angle of Sephiroth for reference photos, so... <laughs> New girl Sephiroth, yeah. <laughs> the curls around his ears looks like he's wearing hoop earrings. I have to, I have to change that. There. <laughs> the hoop earrings are too much. <laughs> Tattoo of one wing. That's so smart. Here we go. <laughs> so close as I can get. Okay, we'll just, we'll just put the bird on him. On <laughs> No, on your back, you stupid! It's not even black like the tattoo suggests. I don't know, he's got a bird on his back. Well, we can move it. He has it on that. Here, let's... His hair is gonna cover it, but... <laughs> the two-winged angel. <laughs> I don't want to see your ass right now. <laughs> Maybe later. <laughs> Stop it. so weird. Okay, I'm, I'm ready to confirm. How do I... Oh, finalize settings. Okay, here, one second before I start. I, I do need to uh, go back to options and make sure I take the helmet stuff off. So I didn't think I'd be making Sephiroth and Frieza. One second. Okay. <clears throat> I'm back. This character creator is so good. Not only were we able to make Frieza, we were made Sephiroth. The Blade Twins. Proceed with these characters, <laughs> sure. <laughs> Setting up your veiled edges. Oh my god, I actually have to play a game now. <laughs> Hold on. I'm still in uh, character creator mode. <laughs> you mean we're not done? <laughs> As a swordsmith polishes a blade, so too does a bladesmith sharpen the veiled edges in their charge. Choose a blade sharpening origin to determine the veiled edges' initial abilities and special skills. Okay. Damn, look how cool they look! Look at these boys. Oh my goodness. Okay, killer? They're both killers. You can't see- here, I'm covering them. These are the options. If I can find my webcam. Killer, breaker- <gasps> Break- Seducer! 
Sephiroth is the seducer. Frieza can be the killer. <laughs> Learn the art of being charismatic and charming. <laughs> efficient and practice movements allow for efficient key usage, and you also be very clever with words to deceive people. Oh. That's so Sephiroth, though. Okay, I'm gonna just put myself here for now. Okay, wait, 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 hold on. Killer. I do like charisma. Cut down those that stay in your way and strike fear into your- This is all like starting stuff anyway, so it's not gonna matter. Seducer uses... Hang on, <laughs> 33 months, this is definitely the seducer. But it, it it's- but then it says recommended weapons. Bring me the black materia, shopkeep. <laughs> and he has no choice but to- but to do it. Okay, beginners like all all rounded. No special skills. Speech craft. I think I want to go for I'm gonna go for a charisma route. Yeah, what skills do you start with? I figured, yeah, because it even says like recommended weapons. It's just like your starting stuff, but it doesn't seem that different anyway. Because the only thing that changes is like plus three points in charisma or like strength or deck. Yo, they could. I think that's is that a gun. Ooh, learn the art of ninjutsu to completely to complete highly dangerous missions, trained in utilizing various equipment, and can assassinate multiple enemies at once. That's pretty cool. But Seducer Sephiroth is really that's like like in, in Yakuza games when you give them a class, that's what they call them. You know, it's like like Breaker Majima or Slugger Majima. Seducer Sephiroth is just a Yakuza class for him. I think I'm gonna go with Breaker because that sounds like the ninja class. And I do like assessing multiple targets. Okay, I'm gonna go with Breaker. Jesus. Look at my blade twins! nearly short enough. Yo! Look at my boys! My twins! Select a character. Well, I'll be Frieza. I'm gonna do Sephiroth's bidding. Or I could be Sephiroth doing Frieza's bidding! <laughs> like, uh, no words needed. I'm saying they're so similar villain-wise, so they really don't need to exchange words. Um, they're gonna try to out scheme the other. Maybe you know what this? I think this is like where they're both reformed. Like they went, they went back to time travel all these different times, and they're like, okay, the protagonist is always gonna win. I give up. I'm just gonna retire to 1800s Japan. Fuck this. And they both happen to meet each other there, and they're like, oh, bro, you too. So this is like the start of the new journey, where I think they're like humbled. So they, it's not that they want to out-scheme each other anymore. The old, old selves would have out-schemed each other. New selves are like... But I, I think I, they're, they're just ready to move on. <laughs> they're, they're, they're just... They're friends. They're both like... Have respect for each other. Alright, I'm gonna play as Frieza first because he's my boy. He's my son. Follow me. Oh, he talks! I have to follow Sephiroth. Bring me the black materia, Frieza. Eighteen fifty-three, Japan. What are you going to use? You're so pretty. Come back here. But actually, I could be like law. It's best to go with something that suits you. Does this not suit me? Genovex King Cold. 
Chosen. I mean, yeah, Freeze is live. I mean, him and Sephiroth. Thanks. I I like uh, that Frieza hairstyle. It's just, it's better because he's got the purple thing, you know? It's the best I could do, but I'm really glad that they even have the hair option. Alright, whatever. I'll figure it out. Yo! Who am I? Who am I? Oh my god! Still not done yet. No, Sephiroth, look, we watched One Piece together. Who am I? Who am I? Sure, you take some time to get a feel for it. Are you judging me, Sephiroth? God, this being parried is gonna throw me off. Straw hat and Wano cosmic. There's, there's a lot of hair options that you can straight up make One Piece characters. <clears throat> How do I. How did it say to switch to my other weapon? There we go. I'm ready. I wanna be Odachi. Odachi Breaker. You're happy with that then. Frieza. I guess so. Are you judging me? Yeah, whatever. I'm I'm probably right. Let's go. Combat review by Sephiroth. He's gonna freaking judge me. Oh, we have the same ones! Training or not, I won't pull my punches. Get him, Sephiroth, help! Help me, my twin! Can I parry already? Have we not unlocked the parry mechanic? Why does he do like the back attack? Can we stealth? Yes. Oh, it's just this. Right. That's Rimba up show. Mumioru. Whoa! <laughs> what happens? Triangle, yes. Oh my god. It has the. I'm gonna take your money. It has the visceral attacks. Alright, with the swap cell one. Oh, it's so hard. They random. Wait, you. Your character walk, can walk around other people's games? Oh my god, they're gonna see Sephiroth and Frieza together! Yeah, I know they completely swapped the shortcuts. It's gonna really ruin my life when I have to try to play a 7 Rebirth. <laughs> Sprint hold release. Does not deplete key while outside of battle. Do you see that? Do you freaking see that? Veiled edge banner. And reckon the veiled edge banner will restore your health. Okay, so these banners are bonfires. This this oh, yeah. this little bucket. Damn, Frieza! Touch the banner. Marty's so overwhelmed. I have to relearn rebirth. Someone out there who made a character that clouded your stuff from the waters of the world. That would be so, so funny. Please. I really hope so. I just walked into a really cool game. I know, a 2024 game? 24? Okay, so bonfire. This is my... Do you have any points? I have nothing.
I'm sure it'll be fine. Sephiroth! Look at <laughs> He actually <laughs> He looks good! I think the mouth might be a little bit too, like, hee hee. But no, I don't know. Sephiroth's having a great time. Alright, I'm gonna get my ass kicked here. Oh yeah, it's, it's her! Swords and show me all no, the trade with him. I'll get the better of you. This no, Sephiroth, no. Use a counter spark to deflect. So that's a parry. Oh, counter spark's triangle. Deflecting attacks with counter spark will cause enemies to become temporarily panicked. <laughs> a panicked Sephiroth. Isn't that scarier though? A cornered Sephiroth. Opening up a window of opportunity for you to deal major damage. Enemies panic sets and decay by the red gauge. So that's basically the stamina meter. But you press it to parry his triangle? Oh, I see. Okay. Great. Great! Sephiroth! Wait, hold on, you cheater! My... Wait, Sephiroth! Wait! Freaking Sephiroth, you- I- He is trying to out-scheme me. He's trying to play dirty. That window timing is so small. That's it. That it <laughs> He's flailing. Dual sense dies all the time. I like the deflect with the, the Odachi. You can deflect repeat attacks with enemy combo using counter spark. Please know that deflecting one attack in a combo would not cause an enemy to become panicked. So rather than focusing on deflecting everything, maybe best to block. Okay. <laughs> 3D brawler stuff about getting those free hits. No, actually. Best way to drain an enemy of key is first reduce their maximum key. Panic enemies counter spark and attack to definitely reduce the key. So they really want you to parry? Oh, I'm fucked. I know your every move. You'll have to do better. Do you, Sephiroth? <laughs> He's becoming panicked, yes! Press triangle when they're panicked. <laughs> Get flailed, bitch. Oh, my allies collapsed. Let me help him up. He's so pretty. Yes. You did well. Harry's hard in this game so far. Thanks, Granny. you will fight me. Oh shit. I will face the both of you. 2v1? Oh, me and Sephiroth have this. <laughs> Sorry, my rhythm was all off. Sephiroth, help! God, the window for her is so much faster. Seamless. Hit. 
What if the Odachi might just be a really hard weapon to use? This hair is so floaty. Damn it, they time me so hard. Working together is the only path to success. Nice stinger. Get her, Frieza! Woo! Too early. Steady. Dude, my regular attacks are shit. Get her! Damn it! I tried pressing triangle, but I get the counter things instead. Okay, so like I have health now. So you really do have to switch between them. Enough training for now. Just like FF7. <laughs> I'm assigning you. I know, I love the character the switching. The black ships <laughs> from America are anchored off the coast at Yokohama. Sneak uh -huh. aboard and steal the secret message in Commodore Perry's possession. And if the opportunity arises, kill Perry. Understood. Yep. You dare question your mind. I just want to know. Well, if you insist. Sephiroth's taking notes because he's just like, has made maybe what I learned here Americans. will help me go back in time again that to defeat Cloud. enough for us to strike. This is the day our clan has long prepared for. When we finally go to <laughs> allegedly reform. Tokawa. No, we we're training under this her. This is an order. Failure is not an <laughs> option. <laughs> Are you ready to head for the black ships? <laughs> they're so cool next to each other. Yeah, they're twins, by the way. Good. I know you will not let me down. Now move. They're definitely taking notes. They're they're allegedly reformed, but they're, it's all a, it's all a, it's all an act for sure. They are twins. It's kind of like Dan DeVito and <laughs> our Schwarzenegger movie. What's it called? Right, that's that's the actors, right? Oh my god. <laughs> they are both aliens. Oh my god, I love- I love them! We could start. We could play with Sephiroth though. Start as Frieza first. Let's begin. Sorry, sorry, twin. Infiltrate the black ship. Oh, we can this game has fast travel. You can say your equipment here. Menu screen equipment. Weapons, armor, accessories are equipped. Slots. L two for details. 
There's presets. Okay, whatever. Look at him. He's tr well. He he's. He, it seemed like he was whispering in Frieza's ear, so I think so. Uh, Mumuryu combats have a highly versatile technique. <laughs> oh there's so much see like the ugh. neo one was really overwhelming to learn but it helped because i played the alpha and then the beta in the main game and Neo 2 has the exact same UI as Neo 1, so it was like really simple to re-remember how to play. But like obviously this isn't Neo, so now I'm like, oh, fuck, I gotta gotta relearn relearn all this shit. Um Repeated use of the same weapon type will increase your proficiency. Uh huh. Perry definitely did not get assassinated at 1853. Maybe we're gonna fail. Even just like, what's you? I <laughs> just throw everything at it. Not nah, it's it's like Neo's Neo's UI is definitely very very overwhelming at first, but since I'm used to it now, I find it so comfortable. It's like everything I need is like where I know I want it to be at. Numbers and menus and stats. There's so many. I think, I think Odachi might be a little too big brain for me. But I want to be like Law. He looks so good though. Oh, I've been meaning- hold on, before I forget. Game settings. Show headgear off. Okay, so we're never- we're always gonna see their beautiful faces. The multiverse thing you get assassinated whenever that's true yeah sephiroth and frieza are the protagonists of the story he's getting assassinated what i say is getting assassinated hey massa these are my stats i don't have any points yeah i'm, I'm just gonna i'll wing it until all right do we swim over <laughs> Swimming in a 2024 game? Yo, we can dive? Am I gonna get eaten by a shark? How are you talking? Uh, ascend. I think I was drowning for a second. Okay, I'll get him. You get the other one. Is gonna be from boat? <laughs> Yo! <laughs> we are one! <laughs> Get up here, Frieza! What are you doing? Do you need room? Or, I'm sorry, I was in your way. Sorry, that wasn't very twin of me. <laughs> I love this so much already. <laughs> it does help that we're playing as these characters. Oh shit. Oh, the formidable foes got the, the chunk. Frieza, let me- I want him to teach him how to octa slash, and then freaking Frieza can teach him death ball and shit. Frieza has his own choir. He's gonna lend his choir to Frieza. Imagine Frieza getting his own theme like Sephiroth one day. I don't think it's multiplayer, you just have two characters. Meteor's basically death ball. I guess so. See, he's gotta summon it. Frieza can kinda just make it himself they're getting there i think i think with their strengths combined they would be the ultimate threat you know this is a bad idea putting these two together <laughs> does have co-op story missions oh that's cool well damn when i get co-op stuff please somebody join it sounds fun
God, the timing on that is so hard. I'm just... Ooh. I'm just gonna block. Herring's really. Whoa! He took his head off, Frieza! Oh my god! My boy right here! <laughs> I love it. Anyway, this is my banner now. He really is a killer. <laughs> You can jump use your grapple on them too, it's pretty badass. Oh nice. Okay, that's that's where the mission guy is. So so this game's actually mission based, not so much like open. Sorry, Frieza. Alright, can we get down there? Let's see a ladder. Is it just, I think it's just the one guy. That's the crouch, L. These two menaces. Oh my god, the double! Because I didn't kill him in time! Damn! These two are so deadly. Oh shit. No! Damn it! <laughs> now I took his head off. They both look at each other like, how'd I do? I did good, right? Yeah, that was really cool. Yeah. <laughs> Heads will literally roll. Oh, that's another way to stealth through stuff. Who's talking? It's the, it's the Ben up top, I think. Wait, there was another guy here this whole time? Well, we're gonna kill him. So many different animations, too. Child's play. Child's play. That's right. That's right, Frieza. Um, you should see my other sword. It's even longer than this one. <laughs> You're right. <sighs> Yo, Jugas. Okay, I wonder if it feels like Ghost of Tsushima or Assassin's Creed. Um, I don't know yet because uh, the game hasn't really opened up. Yeah, I'm still like technically in tutorial land, but a lot of people keep saying it is more like Assassin's Creed. Which I can, Ghost of Tsushima is just a better Assassin's Creed, so it's not like too different. But I really like it so far. Okay, there's a guy over there. Frieza, Frieza, we we need a we need to come up with a plan. Can we grapple on anything? Do we have to rush at him? Uh oh, Frieza. He's got a gun! Deflect- oh, deflecting gunfire? I can't do that. Okay, but if you can counter spark gunfire, your weapon gets set ablaze. That's so cool. Say maker in. I love Ghost of Tsushima. I want to do Tenchu so bad, too. Second character is Sephia. It's really funny with these two. Takes place in Japan? Yeah, it's like- Assassin's Creed Red or something. Uh, yeah, <laughs> having the protags be freeze and stuff is adding a lot to my fun factor. Okay, I don't know if I can deflect gunfire. Oh shit, okay. 
I'm just gonna get shot at, Frieza. Don't judge me. That's too fast. I, th I think it's like when you hear it. Oh, I, I, I did it. My sword's on fire now. You fucked up. Oh, goodbye, arms. I got a gun. Rifles are noisy, but enable powerful attacks at long range. I need a headshot. Okay. Steffi training. Hold on, it's. I'm used to FF7 controls. Oh, what's that? Looks pretty busy. Is there another way? Can I just shoot them? Because they're loud. I don't know if there's another way, Frieza. I think I think we're gonna have to kill them. With my gun. How do I switch my weapon again? Oh, I already have it. Damn, for <laughs> Sephiroth with the gun. <laughs> um. Uh oh. Okay, noisy my ass. No one heard me. They did see the dead body. Oh, he's scared. Oh my god, I love when NPCs actually react to that stuff. That is really not that loud. Okay, he's like perfectly behind a thing. Oh my god! <laughs> Oops. Sephiroth, he's got a gun! I wonder if I can like run. Cause they're they're there. Mm, I kinda wanna stealth. I think the whole point is to shoot this part. Cause I really wanna try to stealth and kill them. Or we can just fall through here. <laughs> Maybe we can climb back up and kill them after. There's a lot of banners. I love Ghost of Tsushima, yeah. I don't know if I'll be able to play it when it's on PC. I don't know if I have the time for it, but I'll try. Ooh. Hold R2 while hook is being displayed. Oops. Oh, I can grab the people as well. Hold on! I want to grab the thing, but my lock-on keeps changing. I'm dead! My- my Sephiroth! Wait, that cost something? Oh, elixir. Guys, I'm pressing R1 to try to parry. This is really bad. The failed edge. I like the weapon effects. Like, just that, that really long line when you attack, it looks so cool. More savage combat. What's this way? But the guy's behind us. I know, I hate when they switch our buttons. But see, that's the thing. I don't want to forget the muscle memory because there's still things I have to do in Final Fantasy VII Rebirth that, like, it's, like, really challenging stuff, so, like, the muscle memory helps. But it just screws me over in this game now. Sound effect are pretty satisfying in this. They are. Oh, sorry, Sephiroth. I need to push you. Oh, let's sneak through here. 
Oh my god, there's chests. A saber? Did you just say oops? Oops. Who wants a saber? Frieza seems like a saber type. <clears throat> yeah, in the parry window. Oh, I'm so screwed. This is why I have to I have to get the platinum in rebirth now or I never will. I really like this game so far though. <laughs> I I know a lot of it is because of these two, but sometimes that's all it takes. I just have to get more comfortable with the game. I hope I don't start to hate it. Because I really wanna I wanna see this journey through. What's that? It's Frieza and Sephiroth. Of course. <laughs> Who else would it be? <laughs> Wait. No, you can't see me! I'm hiding behind a pillar! Sephiroth, you're too big. Wait, that's, that's the guy with the gun? Is this- okay, I was gonna say, if it's like- if it's truly like Tenshu, you'd be able to get past him just by crouching like this. Trust in Team Ninja! Telling create characters make the game so much better. I just feel so much more connected to them. Alright, let's see if I can parry. I did it too soon. Steady. Steady! I'm trying to like predict it and that's why I keep fucking it up. I did it. You're so screwed, man! See, I always hear about how, like, Japan doesn't like dismemberment, but this is a Japanese-developed game with dismemberment, so, like, I don't know. Like, they do it anyway. Figured out why you can make two characters yet? They're- it's just, like, lore-wise, like, it's just- they're the Blade Twins, but I hope I don't have to end up killing one of them. They love it, but censorship hates it. Yeah, I guess so. If something, yeah, if something's gonna be like T T rated, can't have it. But this game can do whatever it wants. Oh shit, dude, that guy frame perfect. Come on, I have to help my my Frieza. My box now. This is for the Black Materials. They're so loud. They're over here like, you gotta be quiet! I'm just like, kicking boxes open. Oh yeah, 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 Future Gohan with both arms. He still fought with one. I forgot about that. What are the rating boards? Thinks we had to censor Saints Row to not get AO rating equivalent. I can only imagine, yeah. That game, that's probably like, like pushing the edge of M rated, right? They're like, okay, so AO, but let's scale it back as little as possible. Still make our game acceptable. Is this gonna be a boss fight? I'm not ready. This ain't no boss fight. It's locked. 
black in the screen for those scenes. Okay, I do remember the black in the screen. It's <laughs> yeah, if anything, it just ended up being really funny. Oops. It's like, no, it's intentionally the joke this whole time. When she will open up. <gasps> Wano? You can open up Wano? Black and silver saber. I don't know about the Sodachi. Kind of bad at it. <gasps> Uchi Katana! That's what they're called? Oh my god, that was my main weapon in Dark Souls 3. Class, I love the Uchi. That's what the saber animation is. <laughs> Frieza, you do it too. How do I switch characters real quick? <laughs> it's just... <laughs> It's just like, like, younger brother wants to be as cool as older brother. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Saber boys. They're so cool in cutscenes and, and in gameplay I'm like... See them as like, brothers. Look at these two. Sephiroth! <sighs> Matthew Perry. It's eluded all others. But my vision is clear. And my harpoon ready. Huh? <laughs> he just sees the prettiest man he's ever seen and Frieza. Oh, you have a gun, do you? the martial skills of enemies enveloped in murderous red aura you have to rely on perfectly timed counter spark i oh okay all this music i know the cutscenes are great with them um i like how yeah he shot his gun missed a couple times and he's just like all right sword it is there are enemy martial skills which can be very tricky to deflect with a counter spark and some cannot be blocked by guarding for this reason dodging something Okay, so it's like the red attacks in a lot of these type of games. Neo 2 had like the dy uh, like dynamic counter or something. I really like that one. Anyway, triangle. Got it. Watch out. Uh, I didn't watch out. I tried. Thank you for the barrels. I got one. Oh, I thought I got it. 
was like, animation? Is that good? <laughs> oh, I have another barrel to throw at you. Or not. Stamina. Oh, I did it. Oh, okay. I see it like flashing red for a second. I guess that's like the moment. That is such a tight window. <laughs> you just stabbed him in the leg. Okay, I can't. Oh, my stamina. Sephiroth, no! I think I'm really just gonna have to start. I'm trying, I'm actually like trying to learn how to parry, but I think dodging might be the way to go for me in this game. <laughs> Sephora said no. I'm afraid I can't let you kill him. What? Oh no, phase two. I wasn't prepared for a phase two. All my people are dying. I'm dead. Unless that's the story thing. Okay. I was like, there's no way. <laughs> Still like that timing is so weird. It's such a small window. It's not so bad if you get one, because then it becomes a rhythm. <gasps> Live it. No! Do we actually have to let one die? I, I know what's gonna happen. I think Frieza. I'm sure they would have just killed off a character. The way I see it is that one of the characters will die, but then just end up becoming a villain or something. Yeah, that makes me sad. I know they're breaking my heart. <laughs> so, so I this dream of entering the live stream. Like, Frieza, don't let me. I've learned a lot from our travels together, and I have unfinished business with Cloud. And Freeze is like, don't allow me! I learned a lot. Now it's time to finally go get payback on that monkey. I don't know who to pick. I don't think they'll die either. I know they have the face icon just in case. They're so cute. <laughs> Three hour character customization is for one to die. Frieza? Frieza live? But Sephiroth's so funny. No! Lose his playable character! No, oh, that makes me sad! I wasn't prepared for this. This is. Remember when I'm like, oh, I love this game because I get to play as my boys. But now I'm I'm feeling heartbroken. Who would we rather play as? Who's a playable character not dies? Right. I I don't think they're gonna die. I think they'll come back and be really angry. A lot more work into Frieza. I did. But Sephiroth's funny. Alright. Goodbye, Sephiroth. I'll see you again later. <laughs> Sephiroth is better as the bad guy. Why, so is Frieza! <laughs> That's true, Frieza's the younger brother, obviously, here. Sephiroth would be rewarded. Sephiroth is gonna go off to Rebirth. 
Sephiroth might be the last boss. I'm s I'm sad. It's not a death, it's a homecoming, Sephiroth. Whoever you are, Blue Demon, I'm gonna make- Oh, I'm gonna pay you back for that one. He didn't die, he just got his arm cut off. Oh, so we assume he died. That was the only trace that- <laughs> I miss you already, Sephiroth. I think it got set up too. So is the whole plot gonna be Frieza avenging Sephiroth's death? What the hell am I saying? Oh no! Look how different they look when they were younger. The two of us are one. Don't forget this. I could not have planned that any better. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> what actually can in Sephiroth scene? <laughs> that was straight of Sephiroth and Nibelheim. No way. With the flames, yeah. Okay, every we're down the correct path. It is really sad to lose Sephiroth, but we we went down the correct path because he's thinking in FF Seven they think he died in Ibelheim, and in, in in Rise of the Ronin they think he died in Matthew Perry's ship. Oh my goodness, the story's all coming together, but it's so sad right now because we woke up alone. I'm having a laugh if it- Dude, you just missed it! Go back and watch like the last like two minutes of my VOD. I promise it's worth it. They knew! That was insane. Oliver's barking. I think he's upset with my decision, but he has to know it's canon. How does the game- how does... <laughs> See, now it's- now it's even funnier that- That was wild, right? It's even funnier that we ended up making- Cause I was gonna make me and Frieza, so the fact that we made me- or Frieza and Sephiroth is even more perfect now. I can't believe it. I'm still kind of... <laughs> I'm still kind of shook. I generally had no idea. I didn't see anything on this game yet. I... I... You'd think I planned that, but I swear I didn't. Oh my goodness. We're gonna have to fight Sa- Was he gonna have one-winged angel music? Would I have sacrificed myself for Frieza? Oh yeah. That Frieza would have been the one to live. I would have been the possible villain. You will never be a memory. And I think that's how we're going to have, like, the, that's going to be the narrative for the rest of the game. Like, we miss our brother. American Rifle. American Rifle just reminds me of my, my dead brother Sephiroth. Okay. I don't, not interested. I don't like the saber. Hello. One armed, <laughs> the one armed samurai. I know that's perfect. <laughs> Thank you, Anonymous, for the gift sub. American rifle, stay away from me. This is so sad, I don't have my- oh my god. What is this? Why are you up? Oh, are they- I'm in fire? You end up just like my brother. <laughs> Blade flash? That's cool. No, doggos. I 
I'm sorry. Where'd you come from? Okay, can I hit him? Sound effect. I feel like he blew up. Frieza's like a cat. I honestly, you know, like Frieza being the little brother, I like this narrative even more. It's like he, he he's like the little brother of the Sephiroth thing, so like little brother avenging big brothers would be death. Yeah, his head popped off. I only played the demo of Wolong, but so far I like this game way more than Wolong. Or by demo, I mean, I think it was like it's called the Alpha or something. I still have to play it though, for real. One day. I love Team Ninja games. I wouldn't intentionally skip it. I just... It came out when there was like a bad time. Yeah, here it's like... I heard the... It like improved everything that I didn't like. Well, you told me. Yeah, you told me that it improved everything I didn't like from the Alpha. Final release is super good. How long did it take you guys to beat it? Man, I think I think it's uh Order food and Oh shit, I didn't even see you! No! I'm gonna die! Shoot! I got greedy. So stutters on PC, even though it says 120 FPS. Interesting. Oh, they stay dead? I was wondering about that. Okay, maybe just that guy stays dead. <laughs> Can he see me? How did he see me? The animation for that is actually kind of... It's like he has to be like on top of you to trigger it. It felt better than Wolong, really. Stupid idiot didn't know I just killed his friend. This is so like Tenchu right now. If I can actually treat this game like like Tenchu, Tenchu combat's a little bit rhythmic. This one, it, I feel like it can kind of get there. Honestly, if I view this as a Tenchu game, I'm gonna love it even more. He's over there. I can't get to him. Fuck. Can you parry the dogs? <laughs> Stop, drop, and roll. Oh, fuck. I was concerned that this gameplay would be parry heavy because I'm I, I can't I can't with parry heavy games like I could if I could like really if I really like put my heart and soul into it but it's like it's so exhausting like I can't chill and play games where you have to parry you know because I, I like games as chill time even if they're difficult I never beat Sekiro 
I got to the owl dude and I'm like, and other things came out. But it's like, yeah, like, I, I don't know. I just, I can't play games that are like that focused on parry because it's, 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 it's too much. Feels like work at that point. <laughs> Stellar Blade's parry heavy. Interesting, I don't know that. Because it's not always bad because like, like I said, Neo 2 had a system where it's like some uh, like a counter. But to me, it was like the counters in that game were a lot easier and it wasn't as telegraphed or it was more telegraphed than like other parry heavy type games. So there are exceptions, but I was really worried that this game was going to be like, like you either parry or you die, but it doesn't seem that way, thankfully. Yeah, it does encourage pairing, but that's kind of how Neo 2 was like as well, because it had like those red attacks. What were they called? I don't know, freaking ultra attacks. And that if you do counter them, it's really devastating to the enemy's health bar. There's some bosses that really feel like you can't beat unless you parry or it's like really hard. But Neo 2 also does it to where you have three different like uh, demons demon spirits or whatever that you can take, like three different types of them. And all of their parries are different. Yeah, burst. That's what it was. Burst counter or something. Yeah, yokai was like your yokai ability. It's burst, burst attack or burst counter or whatever. That's that's the thing I'm talking about. But that, yeah, those were great. And there's three different types of yokai that you could pick and they all had different timing with the counter. So if you really sucked with one certain type of counter, you could try a different one. So even though they encouraged it, they also gave you three different options. Basic what I'm saying is that Neo 2 is incredible. <laughs> I love that game so much. <laughs> and that's the one where I made my really good Frieza. Not saying this is bad. Oh fuck, I'm dying. I'm glad you like Perry. I'm glad <laughs> I find it satisfying. Well, Long had a generous window. Okay. What are you doing? Oh no, he has the high ground. Oops. See, I feel those red attacks kind of feel like more on par with like how Neo does it. Oops. Just that one big one that he does. It's basically the same idea with the first counter. I pressed R1 and block! No! Seriously, his triangles to interact in FF7? Come back when Lisa's back. It's not a reoccurring joke. Neo 2 is actually great. Um, I mean, it's not easy so far. Like, I don't mind taking a lot of damage right now because I'm still trying to, like, use parry and stuff. But I. I know that if you fail parry, like, later on in the game, it's gonna, like, really punish you. Say about Dirge? Wait, what? That it's not a joke? <laughs> Dirge is a very serious game. For serious individuals. Ooh, what's going on over there? Is that a third party? Why'd you kill him? What's going on here? Are you guys invading too? How'd you hear that? I'm dead. Hmm? 
that grab. You're pressing triangle as a follow up. I don't think that's a good idea. I am dead. No, I never beat Sekiro. This isn't a joke, it's an insult. <laughs> to avenge Sephiroth's death. <laughs> Wait! Oh, I thought it came from here. This game is really pretty though, I like all the scenery. Yeah, I... I played- I think I got halfway. I just- it was too long. <laughs> I just played other stuff instead. Ooh, there's blood! Wait, the blood trail? Like in Shin- or in, yeah, Shinra? Are we gonna see our brother? I was about halfway. I hated that guy. What's going on? Is that a woman? I need your help. What if it's Sephiroth? Is He's salty, we left him for dead. We got him! Did Sephiroth do this? <laughs> what? Uh, Sephiroth ends up having the same plot no matter what. Just as I suspected. You mean to abandon the clan and search for them? They are still alive. I have to. Have you forgotten the code? Lady, this isn't about you. This is about my brother Sephiroth. You know I cannot let you leave. You think we trained? The clan are marked for death. Come now! Have you got the people that master is? Oh man. I can't, I'm trying to parry. What's wrong? I did not train you to hesitate. that grab. How will you fight with no twin? Don't okay, you don't have to rub me. it in. Is that Genova music? That twirl gets me every time. I mean, she's gonna attack and then she spins instead. She tried. Sorry, 
No, oh. my stamina! Got her ass. This is gonna be a sad scene. Bitch, you said some mean things about my brother. Can't finish the job. You always were soft. Even in death, she's a bitch. You've been the same ever since I took you in. By the freeze the close ups. I have to avenge the people that made me kill my brother. She would get along with Bugenhagen, that's true. Oh Sephiroth. Ever since I lost my blade twin. I've had to live with the pain of surviving. Go! Succeed where I have failed. Well, you could have said that without fighting me, calling me a traitor. We will avenge our brother. This is so sweet. I really like the cinematic. Let's go! Blade twins are tied together by powerful bonds. If you can see. Oh my god. Okay, so it's been. Some time's passed. Go, my child. Live your own life. <laughs> Die your own death. This is so dramatic with him. Yo, it is opening up! This is so cool. This is Frieza's Rise of the Ronin journey to avenge Sephiroth. I like that. That was, that was a really cool title card. Damn, look at this open world now! We're in Yokohama. Head to Yokohama. This whole game's about Frieza avenging Sephiroth's brother. Look, we got some crap to collect. Yeah, materials, apothecaries. Uh huh, okay. I'll worry about that later. I'll worry about that when I can comfortably be in a menu for like 30 minutes. It's going doing side quests, so it was a lot of fun. Yeah, it seems it. I didn't... We watched all the trailers that they were like showing, but it's been a, it's been a while, so I don't really remember a lot of it. But I remember a lot of like traversal stuff and a lot of like the cutscenes looking really high budget. I'm glad it's good, though. The only people that... Like, okay. The only people... Before this game came out, some of my friends, like, on Twitter and stuff were, like... Like, who review things early, they were saying they didn't like it. But they also specifically said that they also don't like Neo games. So I was like, that was, like, a correlation. And I love Neo, so I'm like, does that mean I'd like this game? And sure enough, I like it so far. Yo, I'm taking this whole ass rock with me. You see like the right demographic? Yeah, it's, it's pretty particular.
And also, I, this game got got a lot of criticisms for like its open world traversal stuff too. But I think it's a, like Dragon's Dogma 2's traversal system is like the same, but in like different aspects. So it's just like, well, why is it okay in Dragon's Dogma, but not not good in this? Yo, that rabbit was losing its mind. Yeah, do you want me to follow you? Are you like the foxes and Ghost of Tsushima? Then, like the graphics, they said it's bad. Well, people are blind. <laughs> that is true. Some people are. But I mostly mean that they're stupid if they think this looks hey, bad. You there. Yeah, buddy? You're a traveler, I take it. If I were you, I'd avoid the village beyond here. Bandits have moved in there. Yeah, these are bad day. graphics, apparently. I came all this way to peddle my wares, but it's left me in a bind. Oh the my god, looks like a PS3 game. How on earth did they let this happen? If you're determined to go, then take this with you. It should serve to distract the bandits at least. Slows all hallmarks recent team ninja combo, so if you hate that, you're gonna hate this one, no doubt. Yeah, and I understand, like, if you don't like... Like, I'm not saying everyone has to like Neo or anything, so I get that, but... I'm just saying, well, I like those games, so... But dips below 60, it's unplayable. Yeah, the frame rate already was a little jank, but oh well. Ground full age actually moves! <laughs> 7 doesn't do that. The one dude looks like an alien. He does look like an alien, you're right. Throw an earth where earthen wear ball to produce a loud bang and attract the attention of nearby enemies. What is holding it do? I thought I had to hold it to like aim and it's like doing something else. That's what Frieza had to adopt. <laughs> Many things they didn't show on bad release date. I think, yeah, the, the release date definitely didn't do it any favors. Um, I don't, I can't really say much for the marketing. I don't really know much of it. I was kind of. Kind of like on media blackout in general for like the past couple months, but that is unfortunate. I release release date is always such a problem though. Game isn't 60 FPS towards them. So no matter what, DDT is a big AAA Capcom release, so it's gonna get more attention actually. Yeah, I really wish this game came out like. I can't say a month before, because that was before I, for Rebirth, but, like, just to think, because, like, the end of the fiscal year is end of March, so it's no surprise that this game came out then, because if it came out any earlier, like, January or something, then, I mean, it might not have been finished by then. Find a good release date didn't work out. Yeah, Alone in the Dark tried. It does say everything came out in, like, that three-day span. Anyway, I like this game so far. Areas occupied by troublemakers. Wait, troublemakers? Like hooligans? Like Yakuza? <laughs> we'll suffer from a disruption of public order and will be displayed as red dot on menu. Being all the troublemakers in an unruly area will strengthen your bond with that area, allowing its inhabitants to move freely and earn your special rewards. I already can see the Assassin's Creed comparisons. Can I use Veiled Edge banners around until public order of area has been restored? <gasps> yes, and that's also in Neo, because you have to clear out the yokai puddles before you get to put your bullshit there. <laughs> Alone in the Dark got fucked real hard. I really, I really hope people give Alone in the Dark a chance, otherwise. It, it was, it was really fun. Oh no.
Yeah, I can't wait to play as the girl in Alone in the Dark. Oh shit. So now 10 games got my attention more than 9 and 10 games. I think there's a place for both of them. Like, I, there's generally nothing wrong with playing like 6 or 7 out of 10 games. Because it's like, like Stranger Paradise, for example. That was, that was like, that was such a 6 out of 10 game that I just loved playing. But it's not great. But it doesn't matter. Like not every like not every movie you have to watch has to be cinema. Not every game you have to play is ten out of ten. And I understand there's like the the thing where it's just like, well, you know, you don't have much free time, so you want to spend it however efficiently you can. So it's like, oh, I don't want to play something bad with my free time. And I get that. But seven out of ten game isn't bad by default. Like sometimes it's just like a perfect vibe, you know? Like, if this is a 7 out of 10 game, like, I'm vibing with it perfectly. Like, this is how I'm choosing to spend my free time, you know? Like, not everything has to be, like, God of War Ragnarok or something. <laughs> yeah, the magic system. Dude, playing as, like, Sage and stuff in that game. Okay, I, there's two of them. I might not be able to... See, I'm treating this, like, as a Tenshu game right now also. Because I can stealth. I'm having the time of my life playing this. So far. Oh, what'd your shield do? Freaking 7 out of 10 this. It's like you can teabag your enemies. How is this not a 10 out of 10? <laughs> oh, of course. Every everything below 9 out of 10 is absolute doo-doo. However, you can teabag in this, so there's no way this is not a 10 out of 10. Oh yeah, Remember Me? I keep hearing about that. Remember Me is like the best 7 out of 10 game people have ever played. I never played it though, one day. Yeah, I don't know. It's just people vibe differently with different things. Like, what's a 7 out of 10 for a reviewer isn't gonna be 7 out of 10 for everybody. Like, that's... That's just like such an annoying mindset that... People can't help but having because like I like Alone in the Dark. I'm pretty sure it got like a two out of ten review for somebody or something. No. Well, I thought it was fun. Yeah. Oh, stealth him before it's too late. <laughs> All right, it stealthed you. Oh shit! I thought you were regular enemy, but you're like the boss of this area. I'm gonna die. Who's gonna attack me first? <laughs> that leaves me and you, sucker. Let's go. Oh, you... I thought I had it. Job, Frieza. <sighs> we did it! Look, public order restore in Honmoku. <laughs> Frieza just sat down. Oh, it's by the fire. I thought he just sat down in the middle of the road. I thought that. <laughs> I thought that was a person laughing at me. Find a find a PlayStation game at six or seven. Score people say, oh, "Wow, this is so bitter." Right? People play that crap. Yeah, first of all, there's nothing wrong with six or seven. Third of all, this is the best crap I've ever played. Yeah, I feel more exactly. That's such a- that is definitely such a problem these days. Like, like Filmer's saying- so in the PS2 era, era, people reviewed games in the t context of what the game had. But... Nowadays, I feel like a lot of people review games comparing them to other games. And it's not always a bad thing to compare things, you know, because it's just like, oh, this does things differently than, like, say, whatever, Resident Evil 2. 
you know? Like, it's fair to compare it, but I don't think comparing it should be a criticism. Yeah, or they're comparing them to what they want. It's just because people, like, people didn't look at Alone in the Dark as Alone in the Dark. They looked at it as they wish it was Resident Evil 2 Remake. And it's just like, well, it's not. So can we talk about Alone in the Dark? <laughs> like, I thought we were reviewing Alone in the Dark, not RE2 Remake right now. What's going on here? I got my horse. Food. Hey, I like your law hat. Can I have one? I got a horse. Oh, just like that. Hell yeah. All right, I don't want to use the horses yet. That's purpose because it appeals to a certain audience. Right, yeah, like that's that's fair to assess Dragon's Dog with you that way. It's like, yeah, it's not going to have like all the modern tra traversal options, but that's the point and that's you shouldn't overlook that. Begging your pardon, but could you lend me a hand? Wait. Oh, I'm like, <laughs> I thought she was talking. You're talking. What do you want? I'm Frieza. This village needs to resume trading. If the horse has got socks. Again. But our stores have been near picked clean while we've been in hiding. Could I ask you to bring me ingredients to make medicine? Otherwise, I'm stuck. <laughs> Ellie Noir for being a talking sim. Shh, I'd love to help you out, lady. I like your kimono. Really? Oh, thank you. I require a red flower for the medicine. Please search the hills nearby and bring me one. I quest or voice? Gather medicinal herb. One out of three. Let's check out this map. Strengthen area bond to increase bond level, reveal hidden information. Gather all the collectibles in a given area, will be rewarded with the completion reward. Just any red flower? Yeah, she's not really being very descriptive. So allow you to automatically travel destinations if you're choosing. Fast travel? Select a destination from L2 of menu map. This ability cannot be used in situations where your movement is restricted or access areas you've never visited before. Okay, so once you've been to an area, you can fast travel. Auto run will stop if you press L or just not hitting horrors. But th what if you like run into enemies on the way? Okay, we're auto running. Look out, people. <laughs> no hands. <laughs> Just being a menace. <laughs> well, this is fun. Dude, he's taking such a weird path. Is this horse... Is he okay? Yeah, the side quest being voiced is nice. It's, it's not that much dialogue, but still. Yo, we picked up red nuts. Haven't tried this yet. Your horse is gonna break everything. Beat the thugs. Wait, hold on. Stop. Stop. I gotta defeat the thugs, horsey. The horse animation of all. I was gonna say, if anything's PS PS3 looking game, something about that horse's animation was very PS3. Can I go up there? It's higher than RE4 launch scrubs got. A lot less review. Oh yeah, because yeah, the other percentage. Oh, people only see the numbers, not the amount of reviews. Damn, our story got so dramatic. We lost. We lost Sephiroth.
You are so fucked, dude! My sword's a-flamin'. How do I run in this game? Circle? Oh, my sword ran out of flames. My stamina is low. I don't know, I got silver coin, but I couldn't read it, all that. Check out the jump grapple. The jump grapple? Wait, like... Wait, you can grapple on enemies and do something to them? Jump and grapple to an enemy? I did... Oh, wait. Jump and then grapple? Okay. How about the dog? Wait, is it... The twirl? Wait, does he do- oh my god, does he do a dive kick on human enemies? This game is really fun so far. Karma! When you max out your karma gauge, you're acting with veiled edge banner, completing missions to convert your karma, earning you skill points. Is that kind of what they do in Wolong a little bit? You're from far away too. I do like that. Yeah, this game, everything's like really fast paced in this. Rare skill points. <laughs> no, my stamina's low. Oh my god. My stamina. Dude, I'm just like flipping around this poor dude. I mean, he's, he's the ruffian, he's a thug. I'm covering the mission, but it said thug. I I played Wolong's Long's beta on stream, and I didn't like it, but I know the the full release changed pretty much everything I didn't like. So I'm definitely gonna play it again play it at some point. I'm just destroying these. <laughs> They're looking at me like, where could you stop breaking stuff? You stabbing her. <laughs> Later on, the enemies hit more hard. Games get harder the more you play. You don't say. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? Is it me? I scare them? Is it because I'm an alien with a sword out? How do I sheath? If I sheath my sword, I'm a lunatic. I got it. Okay, I'm normal now. He is a menace. <laughs> Over there. Oh, my horse is here somewhere. He's a normal alien now, not a menace alien. He's just an alien who misses his brother Sephiroth, okay? He has to avenge him. I know seeing Frieza about his Tanfa. That's true, he was a Tanfa guy. First he was a Kasari Gama guy. I'm not a ton for guy. Okay, so those are the other ingredients. That's the main story. This is so cool. I don't know. I really like this game. <laughs> this is exactly the kind of vibe. Here. Auto run. This is definitely the kind of vibe I needed. Like I had a lot of fun with Dragon's Dogma, but it was like it was like overwhelming for me. I just it's not Dragon's Dogma's time. Wait, there's probably... Wait, stop. Can you pick them up? Oh my god, you can pick them up on the horse. This is the best game of all time. Hiei? <laughs> no, Hiei was also in Neo 2. I played Neo 2 twice. I played on console, and that's where I made Frieza. And in the PC version, I made Hiei. Huh. I streamed it twice. 
Oh, there's an auto pickup. Wait a second. Yes, now that I played the game, let's look at settings. There's a lot. Where is it under? Not cheating on Capcom. <laughs> no, I did like it. I just, I just, I have to, I have to go back and play, play it some other time. I don't, I don't hate our eat. Oh yeah, I forgot there's gliding. It's under accessibility. Let's see what's going on here first though. Oh. Auto collect on. Turn that off. Automatically grab on a ropes and ladders. Absolutely. Automatically crouch before airs that can only be traversed by crouching. Oh, that's nice. Do you think Wes goes in Azure mode that never know? How he commits to it? <laughs> he's not. He's just, he's a weird guy. So when you hold down X, it can for a menu, shortens it a ton. Oh, okay. Yeah, I hate that. Where am I going? Oh, I can uh, resume R1 touchpad. I do think the UI is a little weird. Hold time after you can make one is what I mean. Oh, 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 oh. Hold, oh, that's a different setting. Is that under also controls? <laughs> Where was that? There it is. Um, I'll do a cell, I'll do a three, just cause sometimes I hold things and I don't read. And then I could be like, wait, hold on, mistakes were made. I'm a god not in King's Bow to Gods. That's his, that's his problem, he's insane. Cause he's like, he got this freaking god complex when he found out about Spencer. Wesker and Sephiroth are kind of similar. How do I get off my horse? I don't know how to get off my horse, I forgot! <laughs> I thought it was R3, it's not. It's L3. Horsey run! <laughs> what the fuck is this Virgil ass wolf doing here? Sorry, Wolvies. Thanks. I know it's not much, but please accept this. What am I accepting? Wandering Samurai's kimono. Ooh, equipment. I can I only change it to things. Blade Twins.
aerial attack. Oh my god, look at that sweet 1.7%. Hell yeah. A better saber. <gasps> A deep green. See, this is... This is one... I Like I said, I absolutely love Neo games. I adore them. But the one problem is that you do constantly pick up weapons in that game and it really becomes overwhelming. I want to use my Odachi more. Big number good notters. Yep, all you need. <laughs> you beat one but not two? It broke your spirit. We how far did you get? It's an option to auto dismantle and solo or tier weapon. I did see that. I think I might because I didn't want to mess with settings before I got used to the game, but I think I'm gonna dismantle. I feel like materials are probably more important than Yeah, I saw these. Such a veiled edge bang equipment below the rarity level, yep. Yeah. Is designated long as we disassembled. Can't combine with auto cell. That's fair. Um. So anything below. Well, wait. What do I have right now? So is is gray common? Blues exquisite or some shit. Or standard rather. Here, I'll I'll go to the screen. I'm not gonna auto disassemble just yet. Well, we can go get the medicine now. Come here, horsey. Wait, is that mine or yours? Mine. Mine has the socks. Bunny! Oh, I said collect bunnies! <laughs> Try Neo 2 someday. I love Neo 1. I see you You played the better version of Neo 1 than I did. Because you played it like well after the patches and stuff. Uh, but I think Neo 2 is just like smoother in every way. Plus, like having the yokai abilities really changes stuff, and like the burst counters are so exciting. Right, exactly where, but it was a human boss fight and he had like two spirits and he just filtered you. A human boss fight with two spirits? Do you remember at what point in the game that was? Like, if it was like a couple hours in? Wait, you struggled and liked it? What, Neo? Wait. What? <laughs> what are you talking about? Neo 2. There's nothing wrong with Neo 2. Uh, this mount. Yeah, I think two's better. Yeah, Neo without pat. Well, but that's the thing. Like Neo, that Neo one's all we had. We didn't have like I didn't I didn't see the patched version. Like it was fine. It was fine the way I played it. But like now knowing there's a better version, I never played the better version. But Neo Neo one before Neo came out, they released an alpha, which fucking sucked. <laughs> And then they released a beta and they fixed all the problems the alpha had. And then the main release was even better. Weapon stats, and you should be having 3% more poison resistance. Sometimes it helps. <laughs> don't, don't knock the 3%. <laughs> but yeah, a lot of it's a lot of his like micro stats that I'm like, I don't care what does more damage. Hello, ma'am. You brought the ingredients. Thank you so much. Will this be enough? Oh my, this is wonderful. Now I'll be able to make lots of medicine once again. Is there anything you need for your journey? It's best to stock up while you can. Freeze is so small. Buy sundries. Temporarily reduce weapon and key damage received. 
Okay, so just defense. Okay, so it's a bravery barrier. <laughs> More stagger damage. The thing that I really liked in Neo was getting back your key when you use it. It just made like combat really rhythmic and like I said, there was a lot of like muscle memory to it. Your rage quit Neo, I said I refuse to play more souls like games. This seems this so far this seems a little different than Neo at least. It's more open world RPG and not like combat. Steam has that. Oh it has yeah, key poles. It has key poles? Wait, what's the button for it? Did I miss it? I think in the tutorial I must have missed it. It's not called key poles, it was called not key poles. Blade flash R1, okay. Same button, right? White flash me with the buff. Oh, that's what that's for? Okay. I please come again. <laughs> I'm <laughs> freaking everyone out. <laughs> when do you... You have to hit it like... <laughs> Everyone's so scared of me. You have to... I mean, obviously I'm not in combat. But you get your stamina back, right? Oh, I don't actually have blood on the blade? Okay. I, I mean, I kind of figured because I'm not in combat, but I was just trying to see the timing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what that was. Because, yeah, they, they said... I did see the thing where it's just like, press R1 and wipe your bl blood off your blade, like in the tutorial thing, but I'm like... What does that do other than look cool? Now I understand. Sorry for freaking you out, ma'am. How do I sheathe my sword? So sorry! God, I'm such a menace. Alright. We're fine. Everything's fine. Don't worry. So much to take in. I know. There really is. It's okay. Look, if, if people use Neo terms for me, I'll understand. Because... I hear a kitty. Ponto, I hear a kitty. Kitty? Kitty? I see him! Kitty! Oh! <gasps> yes! Oh my god, Frieza with the cat! Frieza, he doesn't like us. <laughs> Hold on, kitty! Where's- I want to see more kitties! Wait, so petting cats is like a encyclopedia? <laughs> or the collectible. See guys, how can this be a 7 out of 10 game? You literally find kitties and pet them. That's so fun! I don't know what they do, but those remind me of the Kodama in Neo. Like, you'll find Ko- like, Ni- oh my god, these fucking Kodamas are so stupid. Like, the whole point is to, like, find Kodamas and send them back to the shrines. Because they're lost, and some, some of them, like, actually need help. But some of them are so stupid, because, like, let's say- for This is for people who don't know Neo, but if you do know Neo, you'll understand. It was so fun in Neo, but they're really dumb. Like, okay, let's say this this lady's the shrine, and okay, and then there's there'd be a Kodama like right here, being like, "Help! I'm lost. I'm not even kidding." <laughs> I love those little fuckers. They're they're so cute. Sometimes they'd be like Korax, yeah. Some of them would be like behind a fence, and it'd be like, "Bro, you're tiny. You can like go in the cracks of the fence. What do you need my help for?" You have to go like the long way around just to help them. Getting lost in a toy store. I was a little looking for your mom. <laughs> you just stay there. Help, I'm lost. Wait, I'm sorry. Alright, I have to go to Yokohama. Bro, just come over the fence. Like, like, imagine like a Kodama would be behind there being like, help, I'm lost. And you'd like, you'd have to walk all the way around. Like, pretend that thing in the back isn't there, the blue thing. Like, bro, you can crawl through. You don't need me. Okay? But it's really fun, though. I Because, like, they'd play a chime, so you'd, like, hear ones around. 
and trying to find it was like a puzzle sometimes. But anyway, that seems like what the cats are kind of trying to convey. It's like a collectible. <laughs> Hookshot and Kodama! <laughs> we tried being a few centimeters tall. Look, if I would be able to fit through the fence. Which way do I go? With the left path and the right path. I don't want to take my horse. I want to soak in the sights while it's early. Yeah, it is pretty. I really like how this game looks, too. This is like the Way of the Samurai sequel that I've always wanted. <laughs> this is like the Tenchu... Well, when it's in combat it feels Tenchu-esque because of the stealth elements. Wait, what's over there? No entry. Kip the Carrier? <gasps> New combat style, seen only during night. Well, let's go there so we can fast travel. Yeah, the sounds they make when they're chilling at your shrine is super cute. I don't know, Naivas. I don't know. Like, last I heard, they made like... They made three, right? Is that the last Way of the Samurai? I can't wait. One one of these days I really have to stream Way of the Samurai. I don't even know who made the game. I'm afraid, little bunny. I have to run faster than that. I got the bunny! Animal fat too! I think I just killed it. Like this. These always look like doors. There was a fourth way of the samurai. I don't know nothing about that one. Alright, who needs my help? Who am I killing? You? Oh no, he, I couldn't save that guy! I'm so slow. Dude, this spear guy makes it so easy to... Parry him. <laughs> okay, I saw the flash. Oh, yeah. Okay. I think he, he pulse was a little easier for me to get the timing of it because it was like, I felt like it. Felt like it canceled, like it canceled everything you did just with a key pulse, but I just have to get used to it. They just run off, no visible bunny murder. Yeah, I can, I can accept that. The bunnies ran off. I got the animal fat. The win-win. Cleaning toilets. Obsessed with Samurai in a piece suit. Dude, Way the Samurai 1. I was so unbelievably obsessed with Way the Samurai 1 when I was younger. It was like all I played for weeks. It's not even that long a game. Like, there's not much to do in that game, but I played it so much. Um, and then 2 was. I really liked 2 when it came out, but it was like way harder for some reason. I hated 3. Can't wait. Dude, one is so, so good. <laughs> Pretty. Yeah, Keeples is 10 out of 10. That's okay. I I'll get used to this new one. There's something here. Where the fuck were you even- where are you at? Why can't you be a spear user? Where's the other guy? Did he run? There you are. This is fun. 
Oh, the timing. My blade's dirty. There we go. <laughs> ah, look at that. I'm just trying to put my sword away. I have no idea what the buttons are in this game. Being able to finish a run like two minutes. I know, yeah, literally just run past everything. Hi, Kurgosh. Thanks for 86 months. Happy subversary. Look at this N64 ass game. I know, right? Bro, you can't even use the boats. Lame. I'm just, I'm just trying to put my sword away, I swear. <laughs> It's hard! Buttons are hard to remember this game. I know, it's... Oh, don't even get me started. Like I said, learning Neo 1 was rough, but then, like, Neo 2 has a lot of the same UI and buttons and everything, so it wasn't that hard to remember. But yeah, these games are so overwhelming when you try to learn them. Because it's not... Like, there's so many buttons and every button com... Like, every button combination does something in these games. <laughs> but I'm also... I also have, um... Final Fantasy VII Rebirth muscle memory. So I'm like actively trying to make sure I like don't do that. But I also need to retain my FF7 rebirth muscle memory. So I can get the platinum. A locked storehouse. Maybe using a key rust a rusty key found in that area. Wait, are they saying it's here? Oh, there's a thing over there. Sansa key pulse special. Oh yeah, the can the stances especially. Don't worry, it's it's really overwhelming. Don't don't think you're alone for feeling it's underwhelming. There's eleven enemies here. And there's five formidable foes. Well they clearly haven't met Frieza yet. Or myself. Oh I can go up? Wait a minute. Well, this is all for Sephiroth. They haven't met. They haven't met the formidable foe that is Frieza. I'm crouched! I'm gonna die! I don't care what that says. Alright, we can fight he Oh no, no no, come back! Coward! That's right. <laughs> Is this what we're gonna be doing? <laughs> okay, well, it's, I guess we're in a zone then. <laughs> okay, well... <laughs> Gold is strong and red is really bad. Alright, well that's gold. I can handle them. I thought I was stealthing. Wait, is, is it because they're higher level? Like, the stealth is just... They're unstealthable. God damn it, what are... Hey, why have a gun? Oh, not the dog! The dog's a yellow! So is he. He didn't die after that?
comfortable leather shoes. Can I take down that dog? I don't know how he survived bullets. That's pretty formidable of him. If this is what I have to look forward to, formidable, formidable enemies. Oh, looks like he's peeing. Thank you for the leather shoes. Dude, it's so funny in Neo though, like when you try to headshot them and they're like hats fly off, but like it doesn't kill them. It's just like, oh, your hat protected you. All right, the, sh the comfortable leather shoe gang. Maybe if I'm a part of them, they won't try to kill me. Ooh, brown leather shoes. Damn, it's got a buckle on it. That's the that's their leather shoes. It's the exact same model. <laughs> uh, what else we got? We have a new outfit. We do set bonuses. Recover key upon successful deflection and me attack with counter spark. I miss that look. It looks so good. Okay, all the enemies are over there. That's not true, there is a ton here. Okay, that guy's peeing over there. Anyone below me? Oh, he's bringing the shields! Transmog. Oh, there's that in this game? Nice. Eventually. Okay, so there's the two guys over there. There's the dog here. I guess I see me. There's that guy over there. And there's that dude. I'm just gonna be like sploshing around. That guy. Touch no! I touched him on accident! <sighs> Here, what if I run away like a little bitch? Some Hayabusa armor. Oh, fuck. No. No, not the guy, not the guy. Oh, my lock on! No, I died! I, I tried. I tried to get out of the way. Now I was just looking at my corpse. Is it gonna do anything? Oh, Vendetta! 
Yes, initiate against the enemy that defeated you. Slay or deal a critical hit to the target of your vendetta. Reclaim lost karma. Yes, I love that it's called vendetta. Because it literally, <laughs> it's so personal. Like, who took my shit? I'll have to start over? Alright. I know this is, this is like a difficult territory, but I'm committed now. He's so pissed. What he, did he take my brown sandals? Great, now he's down there. He's gonna tell everybody that I'm here. How'd that guy not notice me before? Look at him. Workman's hat. I don't know who I alerted. But I'm gonna get this guy with the shield. And I saw that other guy over there somewhere. Oh, fuck. Can I push him in the water? Maybe not. Together. Did he? Damn it! I was like, maybe he'll die. Look at you, you swim like a fool now. Oh, he did drown! No way! <laughs> I got his key! Wait, he threw me his key before he drowned. What a buddy. <laughs> Fugitives from the law of the Shogun, it can be found throughout the land. Was that a fugitive? That's what the, the, the sign was over his head. He was too far off the shore to be able to swim back, the loser. <laughs> Fugitive defeated. Ta what is it, Tanzaro the Silver or something? That's cool. Man, I love this game. I'm having a great time. <laughs> I know, help, I can't swim. That'd be too funny. I probably have so many skills I can finally get. Oh, that's my saber. I don't know if I like this later. Aiming speed, max health. I think I'd rather have that. Look at that, 0.5% less. All the dude had to do was stand up. Yeah, they started calling it an American rifle, and it makes it gives me bad memories to when my brother died. Man. Oh, the the slaver. Hanzo the slaver. Well, he's dead now, and I got his key. That's for that that door over there, I assume. No. How'd you see me? I'll make you drown too. Here, come here. Okay, maybe you can't because you gotta. Bow. Wait, no, he's got he's got a spear. Oh, is... There my gauntlet. <laughs> the bloodthirsty smile.
You remember my brother was watching One Piece? Uh, was your brother on One Piece? I don't know, I haven't talked to him in a while. I'll have to ask him. Okay, there's a dude over there, but then there's also this guy. And this is the guy... Give me back my shit! Oh shit, his HP. Here, I'm gonna need to fight him over here where we don't alert the other guy. He'll follow me, right? Alright, sweet. We're gonna fight right here. Me and you. Oh no, where'd you come from? Yeah, let's go back in the water. Dude, this doesn't concern you. I'm fi- hey! Shut up! The boy- the men are fighting! Get out of here! Oh, there's two of them! Oh, I'm so screwed. Oh, it's a grab! <laughs> Here, I need to try to de-alert them. Now oh, there's this guy. Okay, what are the chances I can stealth him and then get out of here? Watch this, ready? Okay, now I run. Alright, is it back to me and you? It's totally gonna kick my ass. He's- he's difficult! I'm gonna die! footsteps. Wandering Samurai's kimono! Don't mind if I do. Aw, oh, man. Wait, unlock. Oh, why did it say lock? That looks cool! Um... Oh, locked is... So you don't accidentally delete it. Got it. So the thing in this game, you can easily get outside the area and the AI will want to go back to it. Yeah, I've noticed it's got preset points. Where's Sephiroth? We lost him! We have to avenge him. Or the enemy will just follow you forever. S some Resident Evil games will follow you forever. Uh, Alone in the Dark seem to have to follow you around forever. Okay, so Neo was like this was set. So if you ha if you equip two of the Wandering Samurai set, you get those bonuses. Error recovery. 24%? Arrow attack 15% for having three? Or th also two? That's kind of crazy. These GTA games? Not the cops. Right. <laughs> he died and posed in front of fire. We are living the canon Sephiroth route. In every universe he has to be, he's gotta be in front of that fire saying. <sighs> Alright. Should peace on dexterity? Seen an item that will earn your skill points. Menu equipped. Oh, here. I earned a dexterity point. That's cool.
Okay, and then karma's for increasing that. Now I am in that second bar of karma. So if I if I go to a okay because right now it says um oh wait can I do my stats here oh I can skill points you know my bond my human bonds <laughs> no <it was> Sephiroth <laughs> hi Shiz thank you. Thank you for the raid. Do you like... Do you like my Frieza? I'm gonna hoard my points because I really don't know what I, like, want yet. Allows you to perform counter spikes when unarmed? No. You're dealing a blow, press R1 up to switch your primary weapon to a quick follow-up. They had that in Neo, I never did that in Neo. Increase the damage and key damage dealt by martial skills. Maybe. Also, you unleash a barrage of critical hits against several enemies who have run out of key. What are the chances that a bunch of enemies will run out of key? Oh, how is Mass Effect? I was just talking about that earlier. Use a counter spark to deflect arrows and bullets and then back to deal damage to enemies. Oh, that's cool. If I can actually time it better. The timing for this is straight up Royal Guarding Virgil's Summon Swords. And like the camera angle is the same. I really feel like I could do that. I just have to get more used to it. Weaken enemies morale down. Weakens the morale of an enemy group after you have defeated its leader. Ooh, that's good. What are the chances we're going to defeat the leader first, though? Because usually the leaders are last. Using all your points to increase your healing flask. I do need to get that. I have nothing. Where is that, anyway? Intellect. Oh, dowsing powder. Increase the speed of rifle bullets. Fire a handgun with LT while dodging. That's pretty cool. Wait, how do you make more? How do you increase your healing flask? What table is it in? God, my freaking my eyes are straining. Ugh. A different place you have the stuff for yet? Oh, okay. I know I'm really happy it worked out that way where we made Sephiroth as a blade twin. <laughs> it works too perfectly. Uh no new weapons. I have no healing potion. The heck? Okay, can I just chip damage them? <laughs> Alright, now we're gonna run away. <laughs> about the throwing stars where we get all the good shit. It's about the throwing stars. Oh, and the stat screen. Okay. I can't 
No, this is... This is so... Oh my god, can he come here? <laughs> maybe I should, maybe I should. Then again. They're like, oh shit, is that Sephiroth's brother? Wait, maybe not. No, I think it is. Please don't kill me. Just gonna wait for him to leave. Wish I had another elixir. Oh, he's back! He heard me fucking walk on the grass. Your health going up in co out of combat is also really nice. Did he sit back down? Oh, he's gonna sit back down. No, 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 I'm too late, I'm too late. too greedy because I'm like I'll use my special and kill him right but it was too slow <laughs> see Frieza this is this is the younger brother tag you're doing it all right Enemy weakens. Oh, I have full inventory. You become more proficient using certain weapons. I'd have said it's my storage. Well, okay. So it's very important. I have to go up there. So it's really important to go to the banners as much as you can. When Okay, actually, I had a question for everyone. This doesn't... When you go to a banner, like your bonfire, does this area reset with enemies or if they're dead they're dead like if it's unfinished is what i mean he's looking at me this is so tenchu Resets, but if you clear, then you're good. Okay, so if it's unfinished, it resets. I don't want that to happen. Oh, I'm stuck! I'm stuck! I'm dead! God damn it, I fucking got stuck! So not fair. Vendetta started, it said. Stupid poles. Would have gotten away with it if it weren't for you poles. Wait! It saved. Is that because it's like a checkpoint? I'm too weak for this. Well, I have my elixirs back. Yeah, so the strong ones are gone. Is that- that's the object of my vendetta now? Is 
because that did so much damage. And then you can finish it off! I got my shit back, right? Wait, that guy? But this guy didn't see me? He's gonna wish he did. How many times have I killed that guy? <laughs> he can't find me. Uh, yeah, I, I probably shouldn't be here because everyone here is formidable or whatever, but I'm here. They're so graceful. Oh, wait, he is, he is the object of my vendetta. Where'd the guy go? Sir? I think that's him. No, it was him. That's it. Oh shit, you scared the crap out of me. Sandwich. I'm also glad we got to play as Frieza. I think stealthing. Oh, he's over there. Oh, here's my plan. I'm gonna run through. <laughs> no, Doggo saw me. Oh, Doggo's angry. I'm gonna try to stealth that guy from from the back. Hey, dogs! You even you respect the rules of the boundaries, right? Yes, you do. <laughs> Throwing that guy drowned. <laughs> oh, we got slides. It takes like no damage. I might I'm gonna come back for the rest of this. <laughs> like I think he might be the most the, the formidable like he's very angry and very formidable. This game wasn't lying. <laughs> it's just the other dudes I could take, because they didn't Oh god, there's a guy strung up there. 
Because they, they, they still felt like regular enemies. That guy feels like a problem. What are you doing? Yeah, and he has my vendetta, that's right. Now these guys are annoying because they're not... That doesn't count as, like, hidden grass. Look how little damage I'm doing! I gotta get out of here! <laughs> I'll come back for you, clowns. I'd like to fight the spear one only. I could take him on. Here, spearman? Not you. Yeah, yeah, you, you, you. Oh, you missed the first one. That's what the smoke is, because you take him out of bounds, I see. Oops. God, I'm so- No, don't kill me! Just wait for my health to go off and go fight him again. <laughs> Just look, I know I said I was gonna leave, but this is kind of fun. Alright, let's go. I'm ready. Damn, how do you. What are the timing on that? Taking him out of bounds again. Poor guy. I did it. Paired swords. So all that's left is two formidable foes and two- well, two people in general, so it's the dog and then this guy. I could probably take the dude on one-on-one. -on -one. I would just have to lead him to the out-of-bounds area to cheese him. Can you stealth the dogs? Oh, fuck. Doggy, no! <laughs> He's so angry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> One, you can't stealth the dogs. Two. All right, we'll come back. <laughs> I got some new stuff though before I died. Yo? <laughs> oh. 
Frieza. <laughs> He's got his freaking sneakers on. Where am I going? This place is so hard. Why was I here? Yeah, strong enemy. You don't say. Wait, level six. What am I? Do I even have a level? Player level two? Okay, that explains it. Like, how hard can they be? <gasps> Kip! The shoes Pee Wee wears. <laughs> I can't take him seriously with the running. Um, where's that town? I assume it's only there. All right, so if we're at a banner, I can disassemble stuff now. Wait, is it not here? Oh, oh, it auto disassembles if you touch the banner, right? So you can disassemble stuff on the fly, right? Wait, where do you disassemble stuff? Is it only at the shopkeep or something? What do you want? The earthenware ball I gave you was... Welcome. It's a new game. It came out last week. I find the blacksmith. What can I help you with? She's the apothecary. Please come. Do we even have a blacksmith here? Just these people. I didn't go there, but I did. It is in my menu. Where you can select multiple. Wait, this car is just getting rid of it, right? Wait, where where is it? It is super fun. I really like it. And the stats. No, 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 no. I want to get rid of my weapons. So that's a hundred percent black. Okay. Um, because I my inventory is full. Wait, did I go here? These shoes, I know they're so bad. <laughs> Damn it, R two is not run. Yamate. It's like he's cosplaying, but he like he still wants to be comfortable. <gasps> Kitty? Where's the cat? It sounded like it was echoing. Kitty? The fuck? Are you in the rock? I don't think he's in here. He's over here. Sounds like he's in a well. Is it in the building? Oh, it's right there! Why does it sound like- oh my god. <gasps> Petty kitty! Reason is kitties. Oh my god. Now imagine with Sephiroth. Climb this. <laughs> the shoes. <laughs> ah, my banner now. I love this game. <laughs> the shoes are so bad. <laughs> that was pretty bad. The Calico Stamp universe was Sephiroth. Calico Stamp. Remember when I thought the Ollie Oliver was Stamp? Or Oliver was Sephiroth Stamp? I mean, 
if we're gonna run from here to Yokohama, it only makes sense to put on your finest pair of running shoes. No, I'm, I'm, I keep finding myself going that direction. Like I'm being pulled to it. Reunion. Reunion with the Vendetta. I like that the banners icons pop up so far away. Wait, but what's over here? Seems like there's me a cat in here. Oh dear. There'll be no getting through here. Did you say that? These people are so loud. I'm more of a Rise of the Ronin player. Okay, so that's not a banner. It is really cool. I like it a lot. I'm having much fun. I wish I played a day one, but it's okay. I get to play it day five or whatever. Uh, yeah. Oh shit! Y'all are enemies? No, I'm really good at parrying that one, but I was already in the middle of an attack. Here, do it again. sword one. I don't know when to do it. Oh shit. He almost had his stamina down too. Here it is. Dead now. Ronin gauntlets. He went to sit back down. <laughs> the AI in this game is really funny. Actual enemy is not formidable foes, yes. What a what a breeze. Get the blood off my sword. I know you can tell they know what they what they want them to do. I I for one am glad that they have regions. I just it's it doesn't need to be that strict. <laughs> it's really funny that's that strict. Yeah, I don't know. I haven't really encountered I mean I didn't read the reviews really, I just heard along the grapevine of what people are saying about this game. So I don't know, but I like it a lot. But I did see a lot of complaints are similar to what you could say about Dragon's Dogma. Dragons, everyone's just like, loves it in Dragon's Dogma. And they don't love it in this game, it's just like, well it's the same thing. Like, it was mostly just traversal stuff were the complaints that I was comparing.
Yo, look at this modern looking street lamp though. Are we actually in like modern looking shoes? Are we actually in a weird timeline right now? Steph taught Frieza how to use Odachis. He taught him so well. Big brother taught little brother so well. Oh my god, I almost died. <laughs> What's this? It looks like a modern uh, mausoleum or whatever. It's weird. I don't think they had buildings like these in 1853. <laughs> Sephiroth! No, Dragon's Dogma didn't use uh, microtransactions for fast travel. You can play the game to do fast travel. I didn't plan on rebirth yet. I have like two things to do. I love this. Not as much as Neo 2 yet, but I like it more than the Wolong demo because that's all I played. This is a weird time period where stuff starts to get recognizable, but you still have people running around with swords. I know that's why I'm like weirded out because like this is so modern looking, and then everything else isn't. Plane about to drop the deets. Oh shit. I'm not ready for that, Aid of Helena. There's more modern looking places. Really a lot to explore and find in this world. Is that a tent? Is that a tent or just like an unfinished texture? What am I looking at? Do you see that? That's not a tent. Can I go cut catch a glimpse of this warlock? Okay, it's just it's, it's just the wall. It looked really bad from far away. Yeah, it's fine. All right, let's go towards the progress. Yeah, I feel like a lot of the drag like the Dragon's Dogma two stuff is just uninformed rage bait. Sorry, I adopt Western architecture to get more times. Seems like, seems like they got really good at it. <laughs> get the fucking shoes. Um. All right, there's progress. I think we'll find Sephiroth there. This is just a journey to find Sephiroth. I love this story we created for ourselves. It was so sad to lose him, but now it was like. Feels like it was meant to be. Oh, I got it. Oh, formidable foes. Don't mind if I do. That's on the way to Yokohama. Oh my god, Alter. Yeah, a bunch of people like who'd be like, man, I wish I could have bought the Dragon's Dogma one. It's like, it's like when you ask Saravik, he says, like, because like Xenoblade Chronicles 2 had like the gotcha system. Like, it was built in the game, there was no microtransactions or anything. You just, it, it was like a built in gotcha system to get some of the blades. And like, Cosmos from Xenosaga was one of the blades. And everyone really wanted her because she's Cosmos. And Saravik was like breaking down because just like, I wish I had a microtransaction to buy her instead of doing this garbage. And I so agree, but it's like in every other context, like if that if, the, if those were microtransactioned, people would get so pissed. But then the people that really want her would be like, yeah, I'd have paid for it. Because honestly, that system was such shit in Diablo Chronicles 2. Yeah, it's it's the gotcha's fault. It's not like it's not like microtransactions would have fixed it. Just make the gotcha less annoying. That would have fixed it. But it's like that's how desperate people get with like that kind of stuff. It's just like, just let me buy it. And I don't even disagree. 
I'm lucky I got her when I did. Great pull at the start, Lucky. Don't let her fool you, Cloud. Are you shooting fire at me? It's just annoying because like they should all just be quest related. Or like make the keep the gotcha system if you want, but then also make it quest related. So that people can, you know, get the thing that they want. Yeah. Came with a reusable fairy stone. Ooh, reusable one. Flamey sword now, bitch, get down here. Sorry. I don't like killing all these doggos. Oh my god, I'm dead. My tennis shoes. They are now covered in blood. Oh, too early with that one. <laughs> Did you miss? <laughs> I did it! I got them all. Yay! You're welcome, public order. Is there a blacksmith here? Kitty! Kitty? There he is, he's on the beach! Oh my god, look at this cat just enjoying the scenery! Kitty, kitty, kitty! Huh. Huh. Found a cat plus one, and it gave me something. I don't know what icon that is. It's like a butt. Important North American wolves. There we go. Look, the more wolves I kill, the closer I get to finding my brother's up broth. <laughs> you have to sneak up and pet the cat. That's the only way you deserve to pet the kitty, is if you can out-stealth a kitty. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Yo! Yo! That's like, that's Yokohama? Wait, what is that? That's towards Yokohama. Bridge to Yokohama. Yo! It looks so, like, colonial. <laughs> Oh my god, this is so cool! This actually kind of reminds me of Assassin's Creed 3 right now. No, good way though. Going to Yokohama! Going to Yokohama! Oh, it is like Roroni Kenshin! Oh, what? Can I not go through the fence? I have to go through the secret way? Oh, is that Yokohama? What is that then? What's going on here? <laughs> I'm too low class. Yeah, because the Ishii period? Yeah, I think so too. Was Ishii in like 1830? Something like that? Like very, very close. The shoes. The shoes is why they're not letting him in. I can change. What's going on here? Your chickens. Ishikawa. That's familiar. Is somebody in Samurai Words in Ishikawa? Oh, what the heck is this? Oh, is it you guys? Are you the the cops? Where's the permit? 1860s. Oh, nice. This is like. Ten years before Ishin. 
Smet him in zero. Great scene. He's so always shit together. What gives? Oh, oh, you know, just some, just some character development. <laughs> no, it's great. Um, it's funny you and you and Nips are also both you today. Are like just met Majima for the first time in zero. Oh my god, happy Majima day. No dog is born mad. That's right. I don't have a permit. No one gets so here without a permit. Where can- Oh, I could bribe him. Yo, if I had my charisma up, where can I get one? I don't have a time to be associating with the likes of you. Go ask around at the local village. Why are you so angry? Why is that guy so mean to me? This is the local village. Just the freaking bridge is like barely guarded. Just hop over the fence. Who cares if we're a criminal? Oh, I'm about to steal from these people. I'll show you. Oh shit. Sorry. I'll show you criminal. Soldier's saber. Purple haired alien. Why is he so mean? I didn't do anything wrong. Alien or not, I'm innocent. I'm helping the public order. I lost my brother Sephiroth. Okay? I'm just a normal guy. They don't know anything about the whole spat with Goku and the Saiyans. You should see my Sephiroth. <laughs> Where's the local village? You didn't have a planet named after us. <laughs> He's not ever be the type to enter a planet illegally. Yeah, but this Frieza isn't that type. Guys, come on. You're not letting go of the past. Can a, can a man not atone for his sins? Frieza, don't- I got you, okay? Don't worry. I'm on your side. He's like my son. Search for clues about the permit in the village. Whoa, 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 whoa! What's going on here? Well, let's me use a stealthily attack at range. I would love to stealthily attack at range. How do I switch my bow? I, uh, so that's a gun? Oh shit. Oh, fuck! No. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> I don't know what the buttons are! I called my horse on accident. No, <laughs> he's right here! <laughs> Thanks, horse. I think I just- I have to set it, I guess. Did I not pick it up? Oh, I think it's because my inventory is full or something. I don't know. It's only giving my gun option. It's okay, I'm gonna stealth. I'm gonna stealth and that guy's gonna watch. <laughs> Wait, how does he know I'm here? Oh my god, he still looks like he's actually looking. They're like, I think he went that way. Got these Tenchu ass AI. It's actually so freaking. It's it's so cozy. There's a guy over here. Did pick it up? Yeah. Then why couldn't I equip it? Maybe I'm stupid. I don't know. I'm kind of reading through the tutorials quickly because I'm like, yeah, I got it, and then I don't got it. The <laughs> Kratos. Has to be the wind. The Tenshu guards are my favorite. Out of here, I'm gonna wait for him to come back. Is 
Those venture you can throw. No, like I can't change. It only says shuriken and gun. I, can't, I don't know how to switch my arrow. It's like not even in my inventory. Oh, fuck. Oops. Mass produced paired swords. Wait, is it under. Is it under shuriken? Well, now it's here. I don't know, it didn't show up before. Maybe maybe, maybe it was. I, yeah, pausing mid-throw, maybe. I thought I picked it up. That's stronger- okay, the mer- oh shit, when did I get that? 78. Okay, well I will definitely utilize my stealth bow. What? Dude, sir! You saw me kill so many people and now you have a problem with it? Get out of here. Fall! Will you fall? Watch this, ready? Oops. I missed. <laughs> yes! What a fool. Uh. Wait, how can they see me in my house? Oh, is that the leader? It's not very formidable of him. Yes. Oh, a dog's here. Sword people. Nope, didn't get him. <laughs> Oliver got in his bed and jumped out. The hell was that about, Oliver? He's here now. A lot of people thought Sekiro was a Tenchi revival when the teaser was shown. I'm kind of surprised it wasn't. I was surprised too, but from what I heard, it was like it started as a Tenchi project and it became its own thing. That's okay. I get this. This to me, this feels like an open world RPG Tenchi game, and I guess essential like Ghost of Tsushima was similar. And you know what? I am happy with that. I love these types of games. Oh shit! No, stop! Okay, so if it's at the curse, even if it's a bow. <laughs> Dude saw like three stray arrows fly past him and he's just like, I can just stand here. Okay, he knows I'm here. We did it! Yeah, in the time period. Okay, when you get in bed and immediately remember something, that's what Oliver just went through. He's just like, oh, time to get cozy. Oh, fuck, I forgot to eat my pita. Ishikawa. Ishikawa, that's a Tenshu or Samurai Warriors place. Are you. Hey, you. Over here. Yeah, are you gonna give me a permit? Why are you so old? <laughs> oh, it's his beta. He you thinks it's his beta. I thought I was about to meet my maker. Who were they? Bandits. They attacked our village with no warning. No Bastards. warning? They should have given warning. And now, everyone else is back, thanks to you. We are in proper shape to rebuild the village. I wish to repay you for saving our village. You will find all their loot stashed in the cave at the top of the hill. 
If you're heading that way, you might find a little something that could be handy. What do you say? Handy? Understood, I'll go. Sir, I'm in a hurry to get to Yokohama. I'll do whatever you want, though. I like this game. I presume you are probably struggling to get through that checkpoint. It is likely you will find a permit there. That's what I need. If you need a travel permit, you'd be wise to hurry. You are not the only Ronin after one. I'm not? Is Sephiroth the other Ronin after my per the, the permit? My permit. Go to the cave to find your reward. This old man's just telling me to go to a cave. Stable. Apothecary. Do I not have a blacksmith yet? <laughs> what does Nandayo mean? I hear it all the time. Nandayo. Is it like when they say, like, what is it? Take your time. You know, like, Nani is what? So I assume it's like what adjacent? This is 19. or er, 19. 18. 53. No rush. Take your time. No rush. Take your time. You look after yourself. Oh, it does now. just mean what? Yeah, that's another thing, because I, I hear, like, Yakuza NPCs always say it. What is this? That is what it means? I knew it! Nandayo. Okay, I can sell all of my headgear. I can sell all of my shirts. Okay, I'm going to sell everything. Oh, yeah, I do Take just hear like the Nani a lot. My loafers. Okay, filter. What level am I? What is one to two? So all these things. Oh, you can like hold down and it gets the whole row. Oh my god, that's so cool. Uh, I would like to sell all of these. Sure. Sure. I'm trying to erase it. You look up. Oh, it's got a pole arm. I want to. I want to keep the best of all the types of weapons I have, just in case I want to try them. <sighs> Two thousand. Yeah, I saw that, but like, why did it say it was full? Is it because I was only full on armor? I don't know, because they're like something goes to your storage. Like it says, I'm full. 
Wait, is 50 the amount I can have currently? I don't know. I'm so sorry! Fucking Final Fantasy VII as Triangle as Interact. Oh, and in this game, Triangle's attack. I'm so sorry, are you okay? <laughs> She's so afraid of me because I just tried to kill her. She's like, no rush, really. Was there something else? <laughs> Greg, I almost killed her! <laughs> Our villain arc. Literally <laughs> killing somebody going, I'm sorry. <laughs> at least at least nothing permanently bad happens. No rush. Take your time. These straw hats. Sure. Red Dead, that would have been so bad. You know what? You can weigh the samurai, that would have been bad too. You can perma kill your shopkeepers. There's this guy, you can you, I, I I remember doing this a lot, and I think it was way of the samurai too. But there's this, a, sh a blacksmith where if you kill him, you get all of his good weapons, but he's like really hard to kill. That was like my first Souls game encounter. Blue saw her life flash past her. She's she's probably in pieces, but she's still just like hanging in there to make her final sale. No rush. Take no your, rush. I'm just gonna die. After yourself now. So stuff went into my my storage. How do I access my storage? Is it just from the flag? Stream. We can watch you beat him again. <laughs> Look at you assuming that I beat him. <laughs> no, it took me so long. I did beat him though, thank you. Thank you for believing in me. I do that fight so many times. It was so hard, dude. I remember the field. I think I, I like ran out into the field to try to give us more room. Bye, Pimp. Soulsbar, we would have been screwed. That would have been like patches. Man, I'm so excited to keep playing this game. I'm definitely. I'm gonna stop shortly though, but I'm definitely excited to play more tomorrow. I will stream this all day tomorrow with glee because I, I really love it so far. We have to find out what happened to Sephiroth. I can't believe something as simple as that is just making me like even more invested. So chill for episode and post game content. It really is. But I'm gonna have to freaking do that anyway. God, a stupid mind player. The field. You remember the field? Yeah. <laughs> See, in my memory, though, the field looked like this. Like, it looked so beautiful, but, like, you actually look back at, like, PS2 graphics, it's just like, what is this crap? Hi, Ultima! Frieza's back! Yes! Dude, my- you can make a twin, and I made my twin Sephiroth, so it's Frieza trying to avenge Sephiroth. It's so great. Looks perfect. Thanks! You should see- <laughs> wait, 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 I have to show you my- my Sephiroth. I took a screenshot. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my boys. <laughs> here's, here's a different lighting. <laughs> He's so pretty. He's too pretty. <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> I miss him. I miss my dead brother. I have to show Cervic. And then the Sephirothy became real. I cannot believe I prophesied that on accident. I couldn't make him in Dragon's Dogma too, because there's there's zero purple in that game. So I couldn't do his like hair and stuff. Frieza, put your sword away, you clown. This might be the time the one time where he's not harassing Cloud. I feel like I'm gonna get jumped here. Be careful, Frieza. This game is sick. Yo, what's going on? No! 
Who are you? Is there more men? Ninjas! Oh. That attack sucked. I can't wait to get a new one. Well, well, it's getting lively around here. Oh shit, cutscene. Look at my hot new friend, everyone. Classic. Someone just doesn't know when to quit. <sighs> it seems you might also have a story to tell. I know. Come, tag along with me, will you? This way. This way. Ugh. Come on. I don't know who Greg voices. Some some white haired dude I saw. Follow the eccentric Ronin. The I would love to. Be this way. I can feel a breeze. Plastic eccentric. Oh my, my god, he kicked down the door. Isn't it? A friend who went to Shanghai gave it to me. The world's turned upside down since the black ships arrived. Who knows what will become of the samurai? If we don't embrace the best parts of the West, we'll be left behind. Oh, Donnie, think he gets it for a while? Oh, it's going to be a while. Stick with me, and you'll be all right. Oh, it's so I was pretty. I was in that cave looking for a permit when they attacked out of nowhere. I know I technically left yeah, me too. my plan, but did they have to chase me all the way from Tulsa? Tulsa? Being a Ronin can be liberating. But I wonder if it's worth the trouble. Did they mention that in Ishin? Best parts of the West, aka guns. No, Hell, boring. Do you, you want a high five? In there too. I've got a feeling that old codger might have fooled us. Well, that's the way of the world. Folks would stab their own mothers in the back if it let them survive another day. Yeah. If somebody doesn't do something. This country is done for. He's so chatty and freezes is such a good listener. Hey, I noticed your swordsmanship. Oh hey! You fought just like the guys who attacked us. Ah, there it is. No, I interrupted his this dialogue. Is the place I wanted to take you. This is so pretty. You want to take me here? Does he have a photo mode? Don't know, but I got the old screenshot button. Look, this is. Oh my god, I'm gonna start taking like touristy photos. When we reunite with Sephiroth again, Freeze is gonna be like, so this is me. Uh, eccentric Rodid took me here. Oh, look at my shoes. So you're on your way to Yokohama too. Well, good luck if you don't have a permit. If you're after one, I might know someone. This is me attacking the shopkeeper. The head of the gang of rogues that's occupying the local magistrate's house. They've been busy stealing everything that's not nailed down. He'll have some of his thugs guarding him, I bet. But you look like you can handle yourself. So, how about it? Want to go and purloin some permits? Purloin. I would love to purloin some permits. I hate when the dialogue was long and child distance. It's because I started running and I was like, I'm going to get screwed over. An ill rap. Yeah, Greg, do you rap in this game, like in Rebirth? I'd say it's more like Ghost of Tsushima, less like Sekiro. <laughs> All right, let's let's purloin. 
<laughs> That's the spirit. I knew you had a bit of fun. Oh, meowths and papers. <laughs> rap in every project. So you're a contract. I gotta write my own raps. Allegiance and allies. Submissions allow you to partner with allies whose unique skills will help you to make progress. Partner with an ally that keeps by the. Oh, it's like a chef's hat icon. Oh, it's like with the fan, yeah. Definitely strengthen your bond with that character. Okay. Oh, this is a mission. Mission. Yeah, I was wondering, because I know the game is like open world, but then we got like missions as well. Trigger of the Dawn. Increase the number of bullets that can be loaded into handguns while also adding fire damage. That's his special. Well, long as something so now you can play as him. Oh, that's cool. Hi, Eric. It's actually really fun. All right, the eccentric Ronin is waiting for the magistrate's estate. Cooperate with other players on a mission. This is when I could play online if I wanted. Select allies. Ally list. We only have one. I would love to begin the mission. Time for me to shine. Eh? I'm really like really tired. My eyes are like droopy as hell, but I don't want to stop playing. Okay, after this mission. L1. Yes. Yo, that's so cool. I can play as him. Optional. Defeat formidable foes. That's my favorite kind of foes. Oh. He has a quick shot. That's just if I hold L2, so I can't aim with him. It's a big place. I wonder where their leaders hold up. Albert, please stop barking all the time. I only fight the formidable ones. Our first friend. What's uh, we don't even know his name. Uh, question mark will be displayed for certain missions. They came to objectives nearby. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, let's infiltrate. Oliver, stop it. Dude, let me go to it. Uh oh. See, stuff like this reminds me of, like, Tenshi always. Oliver's barking. Let me just see what he wants. I know, that's the thing. It goes. Like, that's how important the Frieza test is in games. And oh my god, I got caught. I know he's not a formidable foe, but. Bro, I didn't even smooth. see a thing. It was smooth, thank you. Wait, there's three guys here? Is he like Sephiroth and he helps me take down? Let me just start fighting him. Oh, he was scared. I could have. We are destroying this house. No, no, no. Oh, I forgot about you. <laughs> None of those were formidable. I want to play the Tenchu 3 music, but it's going to take away from this game's vibes. Because Tenchu 3 is. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I know what Power Remedy is. Anyone here? I see two blips on my little radar. Okay, they're facing that way. 
Which means... Very nice. Oh, nice, nice. Dude, I wish, like, if I knew they were here, I wish you could, like, break through the screen and kill them. Old Nemesis style. Wait, can you? Oh, <laughs> what are you doing? How'd you get in here? <laughs> combat style effectiveness. Tenchi Jin combat styles each effective. Oh, that's what the arrows meant. Because I fought somebody who I was ineffective against. Okay. Lumrio is ineffective against Odachi's. But the Ronin's uh, Hokushin Itorio style is effective. But if you switch the character in your control. So I'm Jean. He's Chi. And the enemy is 10. Damn it. Will we both miss? Oh, I cannot- I can't get that parry timing down. Parry's gonna be different for every weapon, I believe. We did it! All right, got me so many times through shit like that. Well, oh, like, helped? Or, oh, 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 like, showing up where he shouldn't be? <laughs> Checkpoint! Yeah, I didn't know they could take shortcuts like that. Okay, so there are bonfires. Doing so will cause enemies defeated during the mission to reappear. But just not these, because... I'm in the same room. God damn it, triangle! Every time. Sorry. Black market's here. <gasps> Merchant! The sell special item exchange for silver coin. Don't rush. <laughs> Take your time. I can't eat. Oh, purloinable. Were they purloinable? Oh, here's disassemble. Okay, so black market's here. Let's do disassemble stuff. <laughs> do -do 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 very well. Very cool. Thanks. For your patronage. <laughs> yeah, Polly. Oh, a secret agent's cap? It's a hat. Yeah, Merchant's just like, oh god, it's that guy, it's that guy. I heard stories about him. Yo, Frieza! Looking dapper. It looks like he's got cybernetic arms. Western worker? No, thank you. See, it's a good thing that we went to that super formidable foe area because we were able to get really good armor. Greg to bust in a seat with nobody to see a shit old man. Wait. Oh, his his rap? Oh god. You hear that so many times in like 
the, if you like keep dying of freaking Rufus fight. Yo, Aries Seder, thank you for 12 months, a whole year, dude, thank you. Yeah, like losing to Rufus, just tearing. <laughs> Whoa, you missed. Just hearing the freaking singing at the beginning of the Coliseum fight. That's my friend! That's my eccentric Ronin. Thanks, buddy. He didn't see a thing. Okay, maybe he did. Oh, he's shooting him. Oh, Greg. Oh, <laughs> they do. Because if you lose, well, it's they they talk during the, the fight and that fight's hard. So you're going to have chances are you're going to have to restart it a lot. So you're always going to hear the intro like banter between Scotch and Scotch and they're singing. No. Corneo land. <laughs> Get Corneo land out of Yokohama. Wandering Samurai's Odachi. Is that better than what I have? Way better. I'm so sorry. It's okay. It's funny. <laughs> but it's like, yeah, it's. It's it's like they're not even rapping during that. They're just like singing. President Rufus Shinra, like stuff like that. Um. So the bandit chief is not here. On. Maybe I can crawl out. I can, yes. Oh, is that a man over there? I see. So you can go in the water. Wait, can I run? Just, no, I can't run and make that. Are you kidding? I'm dead. My legs. Ooh, item. This where another formidable foe is. Gonzo? Gonzo? Are you friendly? Are you- oh god, you're one of those formidable foes. He's really formidable! Oh god. Oh, formidable. Dude. He's so fast. He got all of his stamina back. No, I'm gonna die! Hurry, stamina. Oh, 
He's healing. No, guys, he's too formidable. <laughs> His delayed attacks freak me out. I'm dead. I, I severely underestimated this man. He's too... <laughs> He's too formidable. Well, that's good to know you're there. I might try again. Well, I don't know. Yo, did you hear about that formidable man up there? And y'all didn't warn me? enemies healing do they just heal wait what's this it's just like i need a key for it when do they heal is it like like odin like gallerhorn's warning like if the fight sucks he heals there's a grapple point in that area oh yeah that's fine i want to i want to fight this formidable foe <laughs> I keep accidentally healing because I pressed the wrong button. So bad with the timing with this guy, he's so much faster. Might just have to block. Dodge dodge seems like they kinda have weird tracking. My stamina! I'm dead again. You made me work for that. I got him. It's just I it's because I when I try to switch to him in the beginning, I accidentally use a healing item. You can steal their healing and buffs to use your grappler. Oh, that's cool. Like, how much of a disadvantage are we talking? Because I definitely feel like I'm stronger. He's, he did the Sephiroth skewer. Hey, I need my friend. Where are you going? Ready and willing. You must have a death. Oh, wait, so just delay it a little bit.
If he keeps doing that, I can win. God, I really gotta key pulse faster. What are you doing? No, it's like his timing is so much faster now. He's enraged. We both missed. Yes! Not so formi formidable now. Wait, is he not even formidable? He's just Gonzo? Gonzo? Yeah, Frieza, get him. <laughs> What's with the parenthesis dot of the last one? What's in it for me? Oh, I see. Kill him. <laughs> Just kill him. More like Dunzo. Now why? Yeah, what's in it for me if I don't kill you? I know. I've got the key to our That's right, you do. Everything we managed to loot and pillage is in there. Take anything you want. <laughs> There's this contraption. We picked up somewhere. I have no idea what it is, but I bet it's valuable. You better not be lying to me. I think that's gonna save your life. You're out of luck. Kill him. <laughs> I don't know why the kill him is so blatant. What do you think, chat? Should we believe him or kill him? I mean, he gave us the key. We don't. We have no need for him. There's also time to death ball the whole planet. I believe him. Plus, he could be an ally in the future because we kicked his ass. We humbled him. I believe him. Reformed Frieza would believe him with his shoes. No, it's true. I swear. Yeah, maybe he pulls a middle manager. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Never forget this. I'll never forget no, this. If you don't mind, I think I'll go. We'll see you at old gold saucer later, I guess. Gonzo, entry unlocked. Oh, that was the the leader. Okay. I see. Well, I still wanna Aw oh, man. I can't believe you let their boss live. Well, I just I thought he was some other guy. Um, we can't go back and get the op- What happens if you get the optional things, though? Do you just get more rewards? I didn't know what was, like, right or wrong, I guess. Oopsie. It's okay, Ronald, whatever. Kind of guy Frieza would hang out with. He said he'd give me all their loot. I didn't want to kill him. Re reformed Frieza. See, my- Frieza would put up a front. Yeah, he gave me all the because that way we don't we don't want to act like we care. We have to pretend we don't care. And you trusted him. You're a soft touch. Well, as long as we can find those permits. You've got the key to their storehouse, right? Well, let's head there. Said I miss an idea where it Those formidable be. foes are just Come prancing on, around me. being like, look how we're so formidable he was too afraid to fight us. Look. They must be sitting on all sorts of ill-gotten gains. And if I'm right, those yeah, it'd be a waste of our power, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oliver's good. He he ate my pita earlier. God damn it! Every time. 
Super anti remedy. I like these storehouses. These high diehards headband. So you found some Can permits, free to play. You? I don't know. Could you spare one for me? Whenever they decide to put on PS4. This isn't a mere piece of paper to get me past a checkpoint. No. <laughs> Frozen the Baka. To a brighter future for this whole country. It's a future I'm going to help forge. You know, I have a feeling I haven't seen the <gasps> last of you. What's your name? Maybe we can meet up in Yokohama. <laughs> no, probably better not. I'll see you there. Give me your name. There's a clock tower there in the <gasps> Western style. Meet me there. Clock tower. Ask around if you can't find me. <gasps> Where's Ryoma Sakamoto? He's so he's Ryoma Sakamoto. Well, see you around. Ah! <laughs> Going back to Ishin, Ryoma Sakamoto is Kiryu. He's a real person in history. Oh, look at my new friend! But he's also Kiryu and Ishin. <laughs> I like this screen. <laughs> this is so cool. Alter, all you need to know is that he's, he's basically Kiryu. However, I am a fan of Ryoba Sakamoto and other fiction. He's important! Protagonist, not even Frieza. They did both rock the guns. Yeah, it makes sense now. Ronin formerly of the Tosa clan. Remember when I said Tosa? Because I recognized it from Ishin. I just, I wasn't sure if it was from Ishin. I'm like, wait, Tosa, I, Tosa, I know that. I should have known! Determined to keep a steady hand on the tiller of Japan as it opens its ports to foreign trade, he tirelessly searches for the right course of action. An endearingly earnest soul, he is quick to gain the affections of others. Not only is he a master of the Hokushin Itoryu school of swordplay, I don't, I don't know if they mentioned that in Ishin, I don't recognize that term, but he's also a sharp shot with the pistol that was given to him by his dear friend Shinsaku Takasugi. Do we know a Shinsaku Takasugi? Here's the pet, the name. Like an Ishin? I don't think I know that name. It's got social links, right? I don't think it's over there. I know that if we I hope we meet an Okita Soji, because that's the Majima one. But he's part of the Shinsen Gumi, so I think they'll he might be around. Gosh. Oh my god, all kinds of blessings. And I got a glider! Cross the checkpoint to Yokohama. Oh, we get to glide! Oh! <laughs> it will deplete my key. But why? I'm just hanging in the air. Craftsman Odachi. Thank God we don't have to replace our tennis shoes. Historically accurate, by the way. Whoa! Can we dive? This is crossing the checkpoint to Yokohama. <laughs> we just glide over the checkpoint. Suckas. Anyway, I'm gonna die. I did it. I was too scared to slow down. <laughs> Yo, welcome to Yokohama. I can hear the Wano music playing right now. Wow! So much better than chocobo gliding. Oh, already a trouble afoot. So the guards in front of Yokohama, are they the Shinsen Gumi? We're just cops. Who's this guy? Excuse me. Coming through. 
Sorry. It's clear as day. The Western nations far surpass us in terms of strength. If we do not catch up, we are surely done. That is why we must do what we can to learn from them. What is that? Our logo, isn't it? Oh yeah, they're little fast travel carts. I forgot how tiny they were. Who's that guy? He's got a monocle? Who's monocle? Whoa! <laughs> it's even like an animus style Britain timeline. Seeking the prize of a commercial treaty between America and Japan. Uh -huh. Uh -huh, uh -huh. With the city in tumult, the figures who will shape Japan's future gather in Yokohama. We made it! Oh my god! <laughs> Meet up with Ryoma Sakamoto. That's my mission. Ooh. I like how it's so it's so like like old style and then immediately across the street <laughs> it's like modern. It's kind of funny actually. Is this is this historically accurate? Like literally just across the street? I think that educates you too. Look, I'm learning about Ryoma and the, the, the colonization of this bullshit. <laughs> I think it was like that. That's pretty funny, I don't know. The open world? Way of the samurai? A little bit. Look at this guy in his freaking modern ass suit. No, get out of here. Oh, encountering other ronin. You'll encounter other ronin in towns and on the road. Defeating them will increase your proficiency. We'll raise our wanted level. Uh oh, we don't want that. Are you another Ronin? Wait. Sh oh, is this? Oh, this is like the creative characters for other players. Oh my god, she's so cute. Vcom. Wait, does that mean people are gonna see Frieza? <laughs> I'm gonna find the middle manager here. I mean, that guy. That guy was. Old stalker. <laughs> literally, literally freeze. Well, if anyone sees freeze and just walk in the streets, let me know. <laughs> That's so funny. I love this game. I don't want to beat any of those samurais. I'm, I just I want to hang out with them. Can I increase their bonds? Anyway, this game is really cool. I will continue more tomorrow. I'm so excited to play all day. Let's make our first official save.